I know, I know. Ah, nice. TikTok have had an update. Sorry guys, just getting a few bits sorted. We will have drops on Twitch, by the way. Okay, cool. That's posted, that's posted. Let me grab. Let me grab a link to the thing. Oh, we still got freaking video editing going and all sorts. Uh, boom. All right, what I want to do real quick is I want to grab, I want to grab some kind of command or something which is going to link back to the drops because there's some very good drops going on right now. Boom. Okay, so TikTok chat should actually be working, so shouldn't have to pop this out, but we're going to pop it out for now just to see what happens. Then if we head over to viewer rewards drops. Connected to TikTok chat successfully. Nice. Right, where is season 10? Venture forth launch drops. Enable, yes. So, do we need to, to save these? It's going to be this freaking skin, basically. Mm. Tell you what, I could link it to a freaking tweak, no. I mean, if we grab a screenshot from in-game, that might work. And then I can update the drops command. Or, aha! I have a button here, actually. Let me do this. Because I've got a similar button for Warframe. And if I do the same for this. That'll work. Updating! Uh oh. Then basically, I just need to swap that out with a link for the tweet, effectively. That'll be all right. And we'll just make a quick tweet of, this is how you get the thing. This is what you need to do it. Or, is there actually... Ah, we could just link to this, right? Yeah, we can link to this, because this will give you all the information on how to do it as well. Uh, where is the thing? It wants to be here. Oi. Who is that? Uh, find the current drop info here. Or, uh, earn a free Cyclops legendary Roadhog skin. There we go, boom. And then if I press that... Okay, awesome. TikTok chat is working. Nicely done. When you're playing Hawked, ooh, I don't know. Unlikely to be soon. Unlikely. Hey, Jaden. Hey, Adrian. Hey, Ramirez. How you guys doing? So sorry you couldn't watch you. Don't apologize, dude. Don't apologize. You guys do your thing. If you have spare time, then pop in. By all means. Don't ever apologize because you've been busy. Just share some pictures or something in Discord. I'd rather you, you guys are busy and having fun with life and then send a couple pictures in Discord every now and then. Hey, George Bake. How you doing? Okay, so we got plat last season. Which we were, we were basically... Wait, did we go back down to gold? I don't remember going back down to gold. But hey. Uh, we've seen this, right? I think that's the thing that actually got me copyright claimed on YouTube, funny enough. Chillin's sleep schedule has been wrecked because you're sick. Oh, shit, that sucks. Finally able to catch a stream. Yeah, I decided to do a bit of a longer one today because we do have drops enabled. I'm just getting the drops command set up. 
We're going to go through all of this stuff soon, but basically we've got a new event, we've got a new uh, DPS hero, and we've got a Mercy Mythic skin. Oh, we got a reward. We get that for free? Dude, this is such a cool thing. Let me show you this real quick. Uh, adventure skins. Oh, these are just like different colors. Nice. Okay. Nice little highlight intro. Uh, what am I looking for? It's sprays, isn't it? Oh, we have to freaking filter by all sorts. Filter owned. That will help. Achievements, no. Archives, no. The hell is it? It shouldn't be this hard to find the freaking spray you've just given me. Dude. Season 10. There we go. This spray, this is actually... Uh, it's totally like a, a wink towards the voice actress who... Uh, who basically did this when Venture was around for the test weekend. That kind of thing. Uh, that the she did this little reaction thing, popped that up on a tweet, and everyone loved that. So, th this is kind of fun. I like that. Check okay, YouTube comments. Oh, is YouTube things not working? Hold up. Uh, on which one? Which one of these streams? Oh, it's not going to be like the vertical one because that's not up yet. Uh, what do you mean? No, it's it's working. I think. I think it's all working. Love dev doodle spray. Yeah, they're cool, aren't they? They're cool. Get rid of that filter because that's going to screw us up later on. We'll go through the skins and stuff a little bit later. But what I wanted to show you guys is if you are watching on Twitch, and I believe it's like a, a 10 hour ordeal or something, you can get the Cyclops skin. Not that one, this one. This Cyclops skin, you can get this for free. Completely for free. You don't have to spend 19 euros on it. We're going to go make a tweet real quick. Uh, what should we say? Should we just advertise it or say... Uh, pretty cool Roadhog skin available for free with Twitch drops. Uh, paste the image. Then we want to do... Uh, we'll do this. Watch for two hours for that. Watch for five hours for victory pose, and then watch for nine hours. Four of a skin. Boom. And then if we post this, and then what I can do as well is if I grab a link to that. And we can add this into our button because I have a button. Mm, in the stream deck, if we go games, Overwatch, and a free Cyclops Legendary Roadhog skin. Let's do that. More info here. Let's try that button. See what happens. Hey, Buster, how are you doing, dude? Yeah, okay, that sends two messages. That's awesome. YouTube gang pull up. Yeah, you guys are, are not going to get the skin, but you will get a higher visual quality today. It's working. Yeah, it's working, all right. The I might actually, at some point, I don't know if I'll be able to do this and, like, automate it, because the exclamation mark drops. I think that actually works on YouTube, the exclamation mark drops. It should give you a different message on YouTube than it does on Twitch. Though. The Twitch one will just say, oh, drops are enabled on this channel. Uh, these particular ones, these buttons I'm doing are going to give you like the real details on what you can get. So like this skin, for example. But then I don't know if I can like automate it for the different games, basically. Nova has to work, rip. Damn. Hey, Nova, you'll be, you'll be very slightly less poor by the end of the day. That's good news to it. Got a full day of BS meetings. That could be an email, rip. F's in chat for Nova. Damn. 
Nova, uh, while you're here, did we have a drawing of Cars of the Dragon? Did we have that? Because we we're looking into potentially changing around some stickers in the Discord. We do. Okay. I might hit you up a little bit later for that then. Did I have problems launching the game after the update? No, not at all. I This is the first time I've been on since the update. I, I just pressed play. Like, I had to do the update a moment ago, but no, it's been fine for me. It's been fine. So yeah, guys, if you do want to grab your hands on this Cyclops skin, which did have three eyes during the April Fools, uh, yeah, tune in on Twitch. It comes with a, a pretty cool weapon, actually. Like, I do like this skin. It's just that, you know, it's 19 euros, and I don't have 19 euros. Will we carry Mo? Mm, I'm thinking along the lines. Hold up. Let me bring this over. In Arts and Crafts, we were chatting about this earlier. You, you know how, like, this sticker we've got for, for Winton? We might start getting stickers for, like, different members. You know, it would be a small group, but yeah. We're thinking about that. Uh, right, what else did I need to do? Are we ready for today? I think we're ready. The only thing I haven't done is gone live on YouTube Shorts, but I haven't done that on purpose. Should we go through a battle pass or shop or what, what would you guys like to see first? Because we've got a lot to look at. We've got a lot to look at. And apparently, should we start with, with the shop? Because apparently the shop has been... It's been interesting. Some people are not very happy with how things are working. So, of course, as the same with every season, we're getting some bundles here. We have the premium battle pass just available. We have the ultimate battle pass bundle. What does this actually include? You get the you get the battle pass, you get 20 tier skips, you get 2,000 Overwatch coins, you get the Anna skin. That is a pretty dope Anna skin, I'm not gonna lie. And you also get Evil Ryan. Evil Ryan and Evil Anna. That is kind of cool. That is kind of cool. Not the 40 euros for me. I won't be getting that myself, but hey. And then there's no other bundles here. What else do we have? Seasonal. Premium Battle Pass, plus 20 tiers, then that. Okay, so we now have a Mythic tab. 40 euros, yeah. So you get the Battle Pass, which is like 10 euros of value. You get 2,000 coins, which is like 20 euros of value. So that's 30 euros already. You get 20 tier skips, which you could effectively apply some value to that. But even if you forget the 20 tier skips, then you've got two legendary skins, which generally sell for like 19 euros each. So, yeah, it's 40 euros, but you are technically getting a bunch of value if you put value on skins, of course. Your French, please listen to your sing. No, no, thank you. So, okay, here is the Mythic Shop. You can get current and past Mythic skins in this special, like, shop tab. Uh, mythic Prisms are a new currency. They've added a yet another currency because we didn't have enough currencies already. Uh, this is the currency used to unlock Mythic skins. This is a whole brand new thing. And then we've got the Battle Pass. Earn Mythic Prisms through the Premium Battle Pass. So the paid one, not the free one. Uh, each Battle Pass has enough Prisms to fully unlock a Mythic Hero skin. Now, there are some, some caveats to this, which I'll go through in a sec. Featured, this is the one Mythic skin. This is the Murphy Mythic skin. This thing is so freaking cool. The, like, I, I actually want to become a freaking, I want to become a Mercy main. I actually want to become a Mercy main, dude. I'm not even kidding. But I think that, I think this is like the base one, right? But just this, this is freaking cool. Hey, Shinsoul. One of your favorite skins forever, the intros are dope. Yeah, I saw you, uh, I saw you put the intros in Discord. Uh, was it in down here? Yeah, we, we've got Shaden popped all the intro highlights in there, which is pretty damn dope. Still VIP and it's been a year? Hey, Shinto, I don't remove VIPs. I don't go around checking what you guys have been up to. What's a blast like? Oh, even the blast is cool. So yeah, we'll be getting that. We'll definitely be getting this. Uh, you can also buy previous seasons. So the only one I don't have myself is Genji. I don't actually have the Genji Mythic because I didn't end up getting the first Battle Pass. So if I wanted to, I could buy 
these prisms to go out and get the Genji one. If you guys have other ones that you didn't get or you, you miss out on, you can get. Uh, available soon. Now, I believe these ones, because the way this works is the Mercy Mythic skin is available now for this season. You can get it now. You can get it with this Battle Pass. After this season, the Mythic skin will no longer be available for two seasons or like three seasons because Moira, who was last season, will be returning in two seasons. So you won't be able to pick up the Moira one until season 12. So you're still getting some exclusivity to the skins for a little while, but you will be able to grab like older ones, right? So next season we'll have Arissa and two seasons we'll have Moira. Let's go over pricing because the pricing has been somewhat interesting. Basically, to be able to unlock the very base level of a skin, so uh, you see how everything is kind of locked behind levels now? This used to be done in the Battle Pass, especially for something like Tracer. If you had level 1, you'd only have like the, the very basic one, and you wouldn't have any options. Level 2, you start getting a few different options. Level 3, now you're starting to unlock some colors, and then level 4, you get everything, right? So, they've now done that with everyone. Where, if you want to get everything, you first have to unlock the Mythic skin for 50 prisms. And then for each additional level of customization that you want, you then have to spend an additional 10 prisms. Now, the Battle Pass, if you get the premium Battle Pass, the paid Battle Pass, you will get enough prisms to completely unlock the hero, so 50 to unlock, then 10, 20, 30 to be able to get all of the, the customizations. If you get the Battle Pass, you'll get everything. But you need 80 prisms to be able to unlock a, uh, a Mythic skin and all the different levels. I think that's the same with everyone. Maybe not. Hanzo is only 3, so it'd be 50 to unlock and then 10, 20. You'd need 70 to be able to get it. So it's not exactly the same for every single person. But yeah, the more customization you have, the more prisms it will cost to unlock. So if we just go off 80, because I think that's what most skins have, are going to be four levels. I think it was only really Hanzo and... Was it maybe... No, Anna's got four. I think it was only Hanzo, but only had three. Hanzo kind of got shafted, right? Orisa's got four. And Mora's got four. So if you go off 80, right? Let's see how much these are. Mythic Prisms... So this is the pricing for him. 10 prisms is 10 euros, but you get a bonus if you're buying a little bit more. So 50 prisms is 40 euros, so it's 40 euros to be able to unlock a mythic skin. This is outside the battle pass. You can still get them in the battle pass, but if you want to just buy the prism or get them immediately or something like that, it would be 50. And yeah, as TikTok's saying, of course they don't have an 80 pack, it's gonna be 100. You could technically get 50 and then like an extra uh, an extra 30, but that's going to be what 40 plus that's going to be 70 euros or for 75 you get 100. So yeah, of course, of course it's like that. Now before before chat starts going off and saying it's so expensive, they're getting so greedy, this is such a rip off. Before you say that, this is if you want additional ones. If you get the Battle Pass, let's have a look at this, right? Now, I've already got some tiers. This is from uh, previous seasons, from Twitch drops and stuff. Another reason why you should be watching on Twitch. I'm already on tier 11. But inside the Battle Pass, which will go through all the skins in a minute, you get prisms. On the paid Battle Pass, but you get prisms. So for every 10 levels, every 10 levels, you get another 10 prisms. So after half of the battle pass, or like two thirds of the battle pass, you have enough to be able to unlock one. Now, the thing is, just because you got this season's battle pass doesn't mean you have to buy this season's mythic skin. You don't have to get Mercy mythic skin with this season's battle pass. You can buy the 10 euro battle pass and go ahead and unlock, unlock any of these other ones. So they are adding in extra choice. This is all stuff that wasn't available before. 
I, I think this is an awesome idea. Because if, if people really, really, really wanted these skins that were previously brought to the game, rather than just saying, oh, well, here's a mythic skin on a Twitch drop, or here's this one exclusive event you have to attend to be able to get it. They're allowing anyone to be able to get it, just buy it outright, but you have to have, obviously, the prisms for it. Sure, the prisms are expensive. 100%, I agree. Like, if you are if you just want to unlock it, just a single one, and not get any of the upgrades, sure, 40 euros for a single skin is expensive. 75 euros to really, like, unlock everything, it's expensive. It's very expensive. I agree. But this is an additional thing on top of being able to do the battle pass. Pricey, but it's a good option if you want more than one per season. More than one per season, or if you're just a returning player, or if you just started and you really want, I don't know, may maybe let's say you are absolutely into Hanzo, okay? And you've just started, but you missed out on the, the Mythic skin. Or maybe something happened and you didn't have money back then, and now you can, you know? It gives players more options, and more options is good. I know it's expensive, but the alternative is buy the 10 euro battle pass and play through, and you get it for 10 euros. If you don't want to play the game to unlock the stuff for a decent price, then you have to pay the the, the larger fee, and then you still get this extra, you know, buffer of exclusivity where you, you get a couple of seasons where you can't just go out and buy it. So I know this seems expensive, but I think this is actually a really good idea. And the bonus with this is because obviously these are already, like I'd like to say that these skins have made their money, right? So if they are increasing ways to be able to get revenue from stuff they've already built, they are increasing revenue, which means they can pay devs, which means they can do more stuff, which means the game can stay free for everyone. It's a free to play uh, game. And if we're getting more content and more game modes and more maps and more heroes, and we can subsidize that with a few people or like a small percentage who are willing to buy a bunch of these prisms just for shits and giggles, then I'm all for that. I'm all for that. It's not like they're forcing you to do this. They are giving you the choice. So I actually think this is a really good idea. I've seen a lot of people complain online already. I just wanted to get my opinions out here where, you know, this is awesome. This is absolutely awesome. I love this. Uh, obviously, I'll be waiting for the battle pass to unlock this. But basically, I think I think I, I kind of like the very basic ones. I don't know about you guys, but the very basic. Can I not do this? There we go. The very basic setup for Mercy's Mythic skin, I think is the best. Like, sure, maybe the staff is kind of cool. The hair. Ah, uh, wait. Oh, this comes with light hair. Mmm. I don't know, the black hair kind of is dope. I don't know, I like this one. Is the battle pass still 10 euros? Let's have a look. It should be. 1,000 coins. Or 2,200 if you want the special one with 20 tiers. I, I generally don't ever do the special ones. There is an ultimate bundle as well, which comes with some skins, but that's like a, an extra whole bunch. But yes, the, the battle pass is 1,000 coins. Not credits, coins. And then coins are still 9.99 for a thousand. I don't actually need 9.99. So what I'm gonna go ahead and do is this, and hope that this doesn't leak my my payment information. It'll probably be fine, right? No, maybe not. Like, hold up, hold up. Let me do. Let me do that. Um. <laughs> Password. Complete payment. Oh shit, is that not my password? Shit, what's my password, chat? Okay, I found it. I found it, I found it, I found it. You gonna buy the bundle so you can get the Hashimoto bundle? Yeah, go for it. Okay, there we go. 500 coins. That's all I needed for for this. Nice. There we go. Okay, so premium battle pass unlocked. So we will be getting the prisms. You have to get the premium battle pass to be able to get the prisms, okay? 
Uh, I should have probably gone through this before because now I can't say which is the free tiers and which aren't. You guys are just going to have to let me know. Uh, okay, so tier one, we get Good Doomfist, Strike Commander. I'm really not a fan of this myself, but it's maybe just my hatred for Doomfist. I don't know. It's a cool concept, though. I like the concept. I just don't think Doomfist fits this. Doomfist is meant to be a mean bastard, you know? Are our fingers hand... Wait, are our toes... Are our fingers hand toes? Wait, what? Are our fingers hand toes? Or are our toes hand feet fingers? Fucking hell. This is not what I needed at 10 a.m. They may have done it that way because of his talent skin, maybe? Oh, probably. So the, the whole... The theme behind this battle pass... Uh, or, like, this whole season... Is Mirror Watch. Where they take... People who are good and um, imagine them as if they were bad and vice versa. So Doom has got the good guy skin because he's obviously a bad guy. And that's like the theme throughout the whole thing. That's actually not too bad, that highlight intro. So I actually put a tweet out. I saw there's a Kiriko one. I don't know if the Kiriko one's in the Battle Pass, but we'll get into that in a sec. The highlight intro for Kiriko is badass. And we had a bunch of freaking highlight intros over the last couple of seasons, especially in the Battle Pass. And it's just stuff like, they kind of just sit there and look at you and don't really do anything. Uh, let, let me get a really good example, just because I know this off the top of my head. But, that, that's, that's the highlight intro. Anna looks at you. <laughs> you know what I mean? And I didn't find that badass at all. So when I saw Kiriko's one, which I think is in the Battle Pass, I'm not sure, we'll get into it. Uh, I thought, yeah, that is badass. I love that. And then, of course, I put a tweet out saying that, basically, and everyone agreed, but then everyone was saying, oh, yeah, uh, there's more of those sitting and just looking at you ones in the Battle Pass. This is one of them. This isn't too bad, though, with a knife. I kind of like that. I kind of like that. We're still getting credits in the battle pass credits not coins there is a distinction got banners i do love the banners like the whole artwork and everything this season is really good venture by the way venture isn't in the battle pass there is no battle pass thing for venture venture is just unlocked for everyone everyone gets venture immediately which is i think is a huge change a very 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 good you can no longer complain that people haven't got a certain character unlocked yet one for Kiriko, along with Junker Queen and Life Weaver Battle Pass are so good. We'll, we'll have a look. We'll have a look. Look at this, dude. This is so good. I love it. Hold up. Wait, no, chat. There are coins in the Battle Pass now. I forgot about that. Coins are in the Battle Pass. Wait, hold up. So does this mean... That's 200... 400. 600. Okay. So if you play through, if you play through the Battle Pass, the Battle Passes are now only uh, costing you 5 euros. Again, massive change, which is available. They can do stuff like that because of this whole Mythic Shop. Okay? 99% of everyone are going to benefit because 1% of people who can afford to put extra money into stuff are able to, and this kind of stuff happens. Like, th this Mythic Shop is huge. It's a very good change. I don't care. I don't care what anyone says. It's huge. Okay, yeah, no. I'm sorry. This one sucks. This one sucks. I'm sorry, Chaden. This is exactly what I mean. Like, I understand it. I love the lighting. I love how this is actually made. It's just like, this doesn't look badass. If I want a highlight intro, if I've got a play of the game, I want a freaking introduction, which is going to be like, boom, I absolutely shit on everyone. Not nodding your head reading a book. That's just me, though. Like, I can totally see why people would be really happy with this. Personally, not my thing. Not my thing. Mythic Shop is expensive. Yeah, that's fine. That's fine, though. Like, let it be expensive. Let it be expensive. And the intro should be hype. Yeah, for me, they should be hype. And for me, this doesn't come across as hype. 
I, I do like it, though. I, I like this. It's just not for me. Winton, they finally gave us a decent souvenir. I think this is the first souvenir that I'd ever think that I want to use. Ever. Can we have Winton in chat? Winton. <laughs> but yeah, no, uh, I think this is the first souvenir that they have made that is actually worthwhile using. Because souvenirs take up a an emote slot. They they make you stand still for like 10 seconds. You can't cancel them. It, it's like really weird. I never understood the whole souvenir thing, but this is the first one which actually kind of makes sense. But I, I really do feel like Overwatch have been nailing it recently with some of the changes, with all sorts of bits and pieces coming to the game, the additions, the changes, the updates. Uh, balance obviously is always going to be questionable, but hey, depends what fucking rank you are anyway. Now, there have been so many W's with Overwatch recently that I, I'm very happy with it. I'm very happy with it. Uh, guys, if you are chilling out on TikTok, though, we have got Twitch drops going. You can get free legendary Roadhog skin. Make sure you tune in there. Apparently, it didn't follow last time he was here. Was he? I don't. I tend to not look at follows too much because follows is for you guys to try and find the channels back easier. Tastes change. I will play different games. I will do different types of content. You know, like there's many reasons why someone might follow, might not follow, might follow, then unfollow, then refollow. I tend to not look at it. It's why also when the alerts pop up on the screen, uh, they don't they don't come up with names as well, because I'm not trying to call out anyone who might have been in chat for ages and then decided to follow. So uh, like it's it's for you guys. Subscribing and stuff, that sort of thing. Anything extra, absolutely. You know, absolutely. All the names, all the text to speech, that kind of stuff. I got your back. I'm, I'm, I don't, I'm not a voice line person. I suppose the voice lines are more if you main that hero, right? Because here I am complaining about voice lines, and yet I've got a few voice lines for Orisa that I love to spam. So I think it's just because I don't use these heroes, if anything. More credits. So I think you still get a thousand credits per battle pass and then 600 coins. And also... What was it? 80 prisms. Dude, it's it's so... This is just the battle pass currency. Fuck me. Then you've got ranked currency. Then you've got this. Oh my god. There are too many currencies in this game. Victory pose. That's not too bad. That's a Doomfist thing, right? Weapon charm. I suppose you could use that for anyone. That's kind of cool, though. More prisms. So prisms are on every page. You're going to get more prisms. And then by the looks of it, it's every second page, you either get credits or you get coins. Oh, never mind. This has got credits and coins. Never mind. I said nothing. Uh, oh, Brig. Brig has finally got a thing. Brig has finally got a thing. Oh, it's 1,500 free credits. Okay. Even more. And I think 1,000 credits is needed to be able to get a legendary skin. But those only apply to Overwatch 1 skins, basically. I was watching Overwatch. Realize you should probably get the Twitch shop. Yeah, go for it. Go for it. I like this Symmetra skin. I like this. I actually saw... I actually saw... Uh, okay. I actually want to do a comparison. Because there was... Uh, some claims of whitewashing in... In Overwatch, okay? And... The person who was claiming that there was whitewashing going along... Used this image to compare to something. And yes... Sim definitely looks lighter here, but... They were comparing this to Symmetra in the Hero Gallery. Which is not a good comparison, because if you're taking two different examples, the lighting changes drastically, basically. So let's go for, for Overwatch 2. This is a random one, okay? This is the very basic skin. And then let's go ahead and we paste them over into here. We've got Symmetra there. And then if we paste the other Symmetra here. Okay. Oh shit, what did I do? Okay. So, verdict, chat. Verdict. It is lighter. But, it's on a different freaking thing. So, if we go back, uh, we're going to be able to see this. 
Uh, where's their season 10 thing? Hold up. This one. Yeah, oh yeah, no, it's noticeably fucking darker, dude. It's noticeably fucking darker. Yeah, j just these two alone? Look at that. <laughs> There's a spray for Sejuan and Sim that looks white. Uh, is this Sejuan and... No, it was... Wasn't it... Uh, Widowmaker and... What's her face? Uh, Widowmaker and Sombra. Who cares, honestly? I, I wanted to compare. Like, I, I don't think there's any whitewashing going on. I really don't. I just wanted to compare. I saw it on, on Twitter. And you, you know what it's like? You see some information on Twitter, but you don't know if they edited the images or, or whatever before. Symmetra and Sejuan have a spray, but Widow and Sombra one is also kind of pale. Yeah, but then... Okay, so here's the thing. I did also see that. Uh, is it on Widowmaker? Is it her spray? This is the spray. Now, yes. I understand that freaking... This looks kind of... Can we delete this? Yes, there we go. This does look kind of whitewashed. But I think it's just... It's a poor exposure. Like, it's way overexposed or something, right? Like, if if you were to actually, like, color correct this so that it's, it, the white is actually white... Because, like, it's way over oversaturated. Or, like, uh, it's blown out. Like, just changing the white balance alone, fixing the white balance, that is already better. But, like, it's blown out. So, again, I don't think this is fucking whitewashed either. I think it's just poor lighting on the spray, that's all. And what was the other one? Symmetra and Sojourn. Let's have a look at the Sojourn one. Uh, Sojourn here, spray. Wait, why does Sojourn have this one? Oh, is it this one? I mean, again... I, I, I kind of understand, like, the, the people saying it, right? Uh, hold up. If we delete that, get that... I mean, let, let's just do the same thing, right? Auto white balance. White balance alone helps. So happy you'll be able to get a Kiriko skin. Also, the Widow skin is cool. Prefer the last one, though. Uh, I haven't seen the Widow skin yet. I haven't seen it yet. But yeah, the Kiriko skin. I, I actually have Kiriko as, like, my, my freaking background half of the time. I change it every now and then. But do I have it here? Wallpapers. Where's my absolute favorite one? This right here. If ever you guys want, like, my, my wallpapers and stuff, just ask me in Discord. Just ask me in Discord. I've got a bunch of these. Uh, this as well. The the little smirk she has going on. Dude, I love it. Tracer? Uh, the Tracer Mythic. I have... I have this one, which is kind of cool. you got the, the contrast of the blue and the, the red going on. If not, I've got this, which is like the, the poster kind of thing. But yeah, if ever you guys want this kind of thing, just let me know. I, I try and get a bunch of these things. And these are like freaking... Oh, I think I reduce them down to 4K, basically. I reduce them down to 4K because otherwise they're, they're like fucking massive. Uh, do I have an original one? This one is really fucking dope as well. Dude, the Symmetra one. I love that. Anyway, we're, we're, we're getting totally very, very distracted. Very distracted. We were on the Basque Bus. Go back and look at this. Did you actually love the, the wolf pelt hair the most? Fair enough. I mean, this is the this is the cool thing, right? You get to choose. You just get to choose. So yeah, this this was the um, the sim skin. I did upload a a quick a quick TikTok this morning of a Symmetra play. Oh, dude, that screams junk. It screams junk. I love it. This is it Junker Town? Oh, I love this. This is really cool. Dude, that, that might actually become my favorite sim skin. Ah, oh, no, I've got dragon. Or like the demon one. Mmm. Swagger. This is how, I'm not even kidding. This is how I imagine all Doomfist mains walk everywhere. Literally everywhere. They're going to the shop, they walk like this. They're going to the toilet, they walk like this. 
<laughs> this, stinks. this stinks. Oh, please tell me she's got the I can dig it voice line. Oh, look at that. Brig looks so evil, dude. It's good Symmetra more credits. What? Okay, but yeah, that's not in English. I think it's get lost for translation. That's a nice little design for Cassidy. More prisms. That's Anna. Look at this nerd! Oh, what did I click on? Ah! I clicked on a thing! Where is it? Look at this nerd, dude. What a fucking nerd! Where's his gun as well? His gun looks alright. Is, wait, was Cassidy meant to be? Oh, of course, because Cassidy is like a bandit, right? So if now he's if he's gone from bandit to fucking sheriff, that's why he looks. Yeah, no, I don't like it either. But I understand it. I understand it because he's gone from badass motherfucker to to sheriff. Oh, the fist bump with May, dude. One day, one day May is gonna get a super sexy skin. And stuff like this shit is gonna be so cool. I don't think May has enough. Uh, she like she don't. I don't think she's got any sexy skins. Junk tech for Symmetra. Ah, oh, it can be whatever I want. Oh, nice. The ninja thing that goes hard. That'd actually make a really good freaking wallpaper, actually. Something like that. Victory pose. So we, we've got the, the little rock from victory pose and as an emote. Parkour. It sounded like she said parkour. I'm sure that's not what she said. More prisms, more stuff. This kind of thing I count as like filler content, basically. It's basically the skins, like one per page and then like maybe the prisms. Junker Genji. I don't know what to feel about this one, chat. I like his hair. That's an awesome color of hair. Oh, the rusty fucking sword. <laughs> Those are kind of nice. I love the rust on the sword, though, dude. What do I reckon? Is that a yay or a nay for Junker Genji? Honey Jumei? Ah, it's all right. It's all right. I think the problem is May has curves. And we want to see the curves. That's what we want. I don't know. I'm not. I'm not a Genji fan. Junker Genji is a yay. Well, fine. We'll, we'll take Chat's decision. I don't think I'm a good judge of Genji because I'm definitely biased. Again. I get like I get the theme, but I want it to be badass. I want to. I want it to be like boom in your face. I just destroyed the entire team, not like carefully looking at someone. Bam. Talent sprays. That's for Reinhardt. Moira, Twisted Offering Victory Pose. That's something, I guess. That's the Junker Spray for Genji, or the Icon, rather. More credits. Good Sombra. What, what, what are you... Oh, what are you building? Oh, that's like a little Sentry Turret. Oh, nice. More Prisms. Coins. Good Sombra. We've got good Sombra. I'm sorry. Half of Sombra skins just make her look like Karen. She fucking looks like Karen. Now, the weapon's gonna be a bit weird because I have a gold skin on here, but that actually looks really good with a gold skin. I'll have to check that out without the gold skin on. That actually looks dope. And this is what you're actually gonna be seeing when you're playing. Quite honestly. That's not bad. It's not, she definitely looks like Karen, though. <laughs> uh, that's kinda cool. What was that? Talon Mari? Nice. Sprays for Doomfist. Go and, sit down. Go and sit down. Yeah, okay, so I am totally biased. I am totally biased, dude. The voice line, I keep saying the voice lines are shit. Every time it's an Arissa voice line, I love it. I think it's just me being biased. Summer is so sexy. Summer has some good skins. That wasn't one of them. I don't think. Dude, do we get Talon fucking Arissa? Oh, he's got a sneaky 
These sneaky ones, these sneak emotes are great because you actually walk forwards when you do this. It's great. If lost, return to Effie. <laughs> More prisms. Victory pose. Oh, no, she's got a whip. Chat. Chat, we didn't need more horny. We got it, but we didn't need it. <laughs> Mommy, yes. Damn, that is literally be a good boy or else. And you're like, yes, mommy. Damn. We need Kud does your May skin? Absolutely, dude. That'd be awesome. That is dope though. That right there, that's getting a screenshot. I will I will use that for something at some point. Scorpion Batiste. Now that that is dope. I'm not sure whether I like the orange as much. I think I would have preferred it to be a little bit darker. Like, a little bit closer to red. But this looks dope as well. You see, he's got a little fucking horn up there as well. Oh, dude. And he's got the tail. The tail swings. The tail swing. Nah, dude, this is awesome. And look at that weapon. This is Battle Pass skin. I saw someone saying the Battle Pass was so bad and all the good skins were in the shop. I don't think they are. I mean, like, I haven't gone through the shop yet. But hey, I, I think that looks dope. That looks very good. I approve of the Batty skin. Oh, this is the highlight intro for Mercy. Oh, and this is the one that changes, actually. When you have the mythic skin, this changes. I don't, I, mm, okay. So it's not quite as badass as what I was saying before, but I think it kind of works. That and with this skin as well, you almost get to see a little bit of Mercy booty. Almost. Just a little bit. I must Widowmaker is saying. Nice. There is a cat! Oh no. Where's Winton? There's a cat name card, dude, for Brig. It's an evil cat. There are no secrets between us, right? Oh, dude. Talon Mitzi. This is another souvenir. Okay, maybe they've actually made some good souvenirs. I mean, Australian? No, not at all. I I was born in England, grew up in Scotland, and now I live in France. It's a hook, but okay. Yeah, no, the hook, it, it's a whip. It's totally a whip. Okay, brick skin. Chat. What do we think? What do we think? Brick skin changes Mitzi to a black cat. Oh, nice. I love the color scheme. I really do. I just don't know if I like it. Nothing will beat Brig's goat skin. Brig does already have some very good skins. I don't know whether I like this one as much. I don't know. Because the problem is... Oh, I don't know. Maybe maybe if her hair was black, I think it would have been better. I think it's a hair that was getting to me. I think it's just that. I think it's just the hair. But you know, I'll approve. The streak should have been highlights. Uh this. Yeah, I, I, yeah, I see what you mean. I think it's the hair. I think it's the hair color getting to me. I think it's just that. Wing of vengeance, nice. There's Talon Mitzi again. More voice line. I don't care about this. Is the thing. I don't care about voice lines until it's a player I, a hero I use. Are you finished? <laughs> Dude, you use that when someone's spamming. I need healing. That's awesome. Junkrat victory pose. More prisms, more coins. Widowmaker skin. Now, this is actually kind of dope. This is kind of dope. I don't know if you guys can see this. I need a fucking zoom button, basically. But she's got two different color eyes. She got a regular eye and... I don't know which one's meant to be the regular one. I'm not sure. Oh, the gun actually looks kind of cool. That's very classic soldier-esque. 
I love that. Left eye is a cybernetic one. Okay, yeah. The yellowy one. Oh, it also comes with player icon and thing. Okay. I like it. I like it. But yeah, the hair is awesome. Oh my god. The hair goes everywhere. <sighs> On our left. Yeah, the blue one's the regular one. Uh, and that's it. And because... Yeah, okay, so that's what confused me for a sec. Tier 80 comes with Widowmaker, Player Icon, and the Spray. And you don't get the Mythic because you would have bought, built up the Mythic throughout the season with the Prisms. So if you just want to unlock the Mercy one, uh, you need to get to Tier 58. At Tier 58, you will have enough Prisms to be able to go to Shop, Mythic, and you'll be able to get this. You need 50 Prisms. Is there Ryan in the battle about No, Ryan isn't in the battle. Wait, uh, was he? Shit, hold up. No. No, so we've got... Got Doomfist, Symmetra, Cassidy, Genji, Sombra, Batiste, Brig, and Widowmaker. Eight skins. I actually feel like they're, they're getting onto like a really good thing with the battle pass now. Where like every single page has a really good skin. I don't know which one of these were actually free. I shouldn't have bought the Bass Pass before we looked through. I tend to do that where, you know, you have a look at the skins before you buy and it tells you which ones are free. But after you've bought the Bass Pass, it doesn't tell you which ones are free anymore. Okay, right. Because it's not going to show us the, the other skins coming here, I don't think. So what we're going to do is go into Heroes. And we're going to have a look at stuff which is upcoming so we've got doom we've seen doom we've seen that orissa skins now this one this is not up and coming one I, I presume these are all going to be shops i'm not sure this one doesn't actually say shop so this might be an event or something uh this looks very very similar to her null sector one uh where is it Wait, can we not see Null Sector anymore? Oh, here it is. This. Ryan is tier one. No, Ryan is... It's Doomfist on tier one. Ryan's in a $40 pack. Okay, yeah, there you go. I knew I'd seen it. You want a previous Mythics and recent ones? You have to choose which you kind of don't like. Yes, but... He, okay, counter argument. You didn't have the choice before. Now you do. Now you have the choice whether you want to have a look at previous seasons or get the current one. You can either get do that for 10 euros or you can get both for a little bit more expensive. If you are buying the prisms just outright to get previous skins, yes, they are expensive. But you have the choice now. You didn't have the choice before. And because they are including that... The Battle Pass now has coins in, which means that, like, 90% of everyone who is getting the Battle Pass will just get the Battle Pass for, like, 5 viewers instead. Mythic skins feel like a money scam? Oh, absolutely not. Absolutely not. 100% not. It's a free game. They are offering free content. Regular updates, seasonal stuff, new heroes, new skins, new modes new weapon skin they're coming out with a bunch of content you have to pay the dev somehow okay you have to pay, pay them somehow and if you are pleasing so many extra people you have got credits in the battle pass you have got now coins in the battle pass you've got all these extra bits and pieces and you have the mythic skin in the battle pass you're including all of that for effectively five euros a month Effectively, five euros a month, you are getting that level of content. Plus all the free stuff that goes along with it. Okay? They have to make their money somehow. Sure, some of the shop skins might be a little bit expensive. The, the premium packs, sure, might be expensive. But this kind of thing, this is stupid expensive, right? Stupid expensive. But I think it's fine. But if you just want to unlock one, it's 40 euros. Again, 
expensive, but it gives you the option. If you want to completely unlock one, it's basically 70 or 75. It's basically 75 euros. Which again, super expensive, but for something which you miss out on. Because at the end of the day, the developers want you to play the game. Sure, they have the business side of things where they have to pay the developers to be able to create the content, but as they want you, they'd rather you play the game than you pay them. They'd rather have you pay the five euros you need for the battle pass and play through enough to be able to unlock it rather than go out and buy outright a skin. Sure, earning money pays the devs. They need to earn money somehow, but at the end of the day, the developers want you to play. That includes a new mythic. Yeah, so when you get the battle pass, you can either get the new mythic or like you can get any of the other ones. You don't have to get the new one. Like if you really don't like the mercy one for whatever reason, you can go back and get any uh, other one here. Controversial opinion, but the battle pass should give you more coins prisms for for tier like 400. No, I don't think so. I think it's fine. I think it's fine. Like quite honestly, I know there's a bunch of filler content in the battle pass. You need filler content. You can't have 80 tiers of absolute amazing skins. They take time and money to develop, right? So there's a bunch of like silly things like icons and, you know, credits and maybe some banners and bits and pieces. But like some of these skins, some of these silly little bits will be like the favorite thing for someone. You know, maybe this just like really vibes with someone. Battle Pass plus the newest mythic. If you just get the Battle Pass, so all I have done today is spend $4.99 on the Battle Pass. I only needed 500 coins. I already had some left over. I will get 600 from the season. So again, next season, I'll have to spend $4.99. And basically, I'm getting all of the skins. I'm getting 1,500 credits, which allows me to buy extra stuff. Allows me to buy emotes, highlight intros, old skins, that kind of thing. You also get 80 prisms included in that. This is only for the premium battle pass. If you don't buy the battle pass, you don't get this. But I can get the full Mercy Mythic with the battle pass. With the $5.99 or $4.99. Or if I really don't want the Mercy one, I can get something else. Previous Genjins are Genji and Brit. Yeah, there's Genji, Brit. There's a bunch of other ones. We've just gone through everything. But yeah, no, I, I really like this way of working. I really like this. I, I don't care if people say this is like a fucking scam or whatever. This is actually really well done. And if you do get the latest one, you then get like two seasons of exclusiveness. So it shows you very clearly that Moira will return in two seasons. Moira will be back. So you still get that little exclusivity thing. But hey, no, I, I really enjoy this. I really like what we've done. Right, let's go back to see the skins. What have we missed? I kind of like this future retro one. I don't think I'd wear that, but it's cute. It's different. And I think that's something that's been missing for Orisa for a little while. It's something that's different. A lot of the Orisa skins have been very, very similar. This is the Rhine skin. This is the one someone was asking about. This is only available in the premium uh, bundle, along with the Anna skin. It looks all right. Looks alright. And that comes with this one. This is a really good Anna skin, by the way. Anna's looking good. What do you mean returns in two seasons? Mora Mythic is there. It's there, but you can't buy it. You can't buy it until another two seasons. Same with Orisa. You can't buy Orisa yet. You'll be able to buy Orisa next season. So you still get that small period of exclusivity, but you will be able to unlock it. Zarya Talon? Oh, the weapon looks dope, dude. I love Talon's color schemes. The black, red, and white is so simple, and yet it just works. Is that a Tesla icon? <laughs> that looks like Tesla. Uh, we don't get any mean ash. We've seen Cassidy's. Echo? Retro Future again? Not a fan. I'm not a fan of this one. I'm sorry. I don't like this one. Blizzard have just stolen more of your hard-earned cash. <laughs> they're good. They're good at this. Like the, the whole skins and themes and stuff, they're, they're spot on. Oh. 
Oh no, chat. Okay, so this is a skin for Hanzo, which is fine. Okay, this is a pretty cool skin. I like this, but are you guys ready for this? Hanzo has been reduced to Uwu. <laughs> He's been reduced to Uwu! He's become a pussycat. He's literally- This looks so weird with a mythic skin applied, by the way. <laughs> the Seraphim bundle almost bankrupted me. Aw, oh, dude. I kind of wanted to get the Sombra one, honestly, but it was so expensive. So, so very expensive. What else do we have? Who else is getting a skin in this season? Sojourn Night Ops. I saw someone complaining about this on, on Twitter. Someone was basically saying that this skin wasn't like good, okay? But more than just that, they were comparing that skin to Kiriko's skin, which I think is absolutely fucking dope. If this comes in the, sh in the shop, I am buying this. I don't even care. This looks dope as fuck. And they said it was racist. They said that the reason why Kiriko's skin is better than Sejourn's skin is because they're racist. And I was just like, you mean Overwatch, the game which has people from all over the world, from other fucking planets, it has every single fucking sexual identity you can kind of imagine. They're racist? What? Like, don't, don't get me wrong, this is a dope-ass skin. But this is meant to be like a, a legend- not a legendary, what's the one underneath legendary? I don't know what these are fucking called. Epic. This is an epic skin. I think this is pretty dope. I love the green highlights. I love this. She's actually got green eyes in that as well. Whereas the Kiriko one is a legendary. So yeah, this one is meant to be a little bit better, but you're not comparing an epic with an epic, you're comparing an epic with a legendary. This will probably also come with a higher price. I can guarantee you this is going to be 20 euros. Absolutely. Don't think that Sojourn having bad skins is racist. Absolutely not. It's definitely not. Like, Sojourn does lack in some skins. I'm not going to lie. Like, if we remove the filter here, she's got 11 skins. The base one, obviously, like, the three different colors, which are very basic, or four different colors, because I actually unlocked one. Uh, she's got a couple extra ones here. I think it was actually one I haven't unlocked from doing the, the missions, which I probably should have at some point. But yeah, I don't think she's got very good skins. I really don't. I think Sejuan does need some more love. But this looks freaking dope. I love this. Like a barista one? I don't. I just generally don't like Sejuan skins. Which is not good for me. This skin though, this is a really good one. Uh, Z7 Miles, thank you very much for GG. Like a biker skin from a PvE quest? Yeah, I, I need to unlock that at some point. I still haven't done that. Maybe, maybe we do that at some point today, because you still get XP from that, right? Uh, Sombra, we've seen... Sombra, we had this discussion earlier, where Sombra has, like, some really, really good skins. Uh, where is... Uh, no, hold up. We need everything. Where... This one. This is what I think is Sombra's, like, sexiest skin. Her best one. Hands down. Hands down. Aztec isn't too bad as well. I like Aztec. Formal one is fancy. Formal, formal. Wait, does she have a formal one? I don't see it on here. This is another really good one. I was actually hesitating on getting this one. This is such a good Sombra skin. I love this one. And you can't get it now. Shop locked. Oh, for Sojourn. Oh, my bad. I don't like this one. This one, it wasn't this one, but you could get something like this for basically for free. I, I might have not have actually picked it up. Or did I? I don't know. But yeah, no, but there's a bunch of these ones that just make her look like Karen. Demon Hunter, this was the one. Or vice versa, it was one of, one of those way crowns. Yeah, it, it costs like a bunch of freaking points. 
Uh, moving on. Symmetra, we've seen Torb. Doesn't get anything. Tracer. Tracer's skin. Now, it, it doesn't actually ship. Her victory pose with this. The skin looks all right, okay? The skin looks all right. But the victory pose that goes with it, the combo of the victory pose and the skin, it just hits that spot. Are you streaming on Twitch? Yeah, Twitch, TikTok, and YouTube at the same time. If you guys want, there are Twitch drops going on. If you are watching on Twitch, you get a free Roadhog skin. Showing stomach is printing me off in this Tracer skin. Oh, in this, uh, in this bit. I don't know. That's not doing anything for me, but yeah. I see what you mean. But yeah, no, but this is another really good skin. I love this. But you combine the two, the victory pose with that. Very good. How do you get the rewards by watching on Twitch? Uh, I just sent a link to Twitch chat. Uh, literally, all you have to do is make sure you have linked your Twitch account with your Overwatch account, which I believe you can do on your Overwatch account or your Blizzard account, like straight on their website. And then, yeah, you just watch and make sure you, you claim... Oh, wait. Ven Venture doesn't have any skins? Venture only has the basic skins? Nah, dude. Hold up. Hold up. What? They have, but it's not in game yet. Okay. I hope they get something. Because releasing with just four, like, very basic ones. Do you claim the Roadhog skin, but it's not in your locker? You have to watch for nine hours total. And then, yeah, try restarting the game. It can take a little while for it to update. Uh, yeah, we've got rid of the filters. Where is it? Roadhog. Uh, Cyclops, it's this one. It can take a little while to, to update. Generally, though, if you restart the game, it'll be fine. Make sure you have linked everything correctly. Unfortunately, it's a shop skin. That's... I don't mind. I don't mind if it's a shop skin. I just want them to have something, right? Because releasing with just these four options... Although, like, the options are decent, right? They're colorful. They're basic, but they're colorful. I kind of really like the blue and orange one. Or the yellow and red one. Okay, should we unlock one? Which one should we get, chat? Yellow one or the blue one? Type in chat. I'll, I'll go with it, whatever chat chooses. Every new hero got a, a new skin with a release? I think so. But Chazen's saying it's going to be later on in the season. It's just not actually in the game files yet. Yellow, blue, blue, yellow, blue, blue, blue. Oh, there's a lot of blue. Okay, okay, blue. Mostly blues. Make sure we equip that. Do we give the highlight intros and everything? That's freaking dope. And then what's the heroic one? Ah, uh, yeah, this is a basic one. Screw it. Let's go for it. I've got a bunch of these credits from battle passes anyway, so... This is the emotes. Rock. Knee slapper. Settle in. Dude, I love that. That is so cute. We're getting that one. <laughs> Need to use Battle.net to link the account. Yeah, you, you have to go on to... It will be on your account. Uh, it's probably everywhere. Basically, hold up. If you're if you're in Twitch chat, there should be a link here. This here. This is a form. Earn Colossal Rewards for Roadhog on Twitch. And basically, it tells you exactly how to get it. Uh, simply connect your Battle.net account with your Twitch account, tune in, blah, 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 blah. It, it gives you a bunch of frequently asked questions as well. There's everything on here. This is linked in Twitch chat right now. All right, what else do we need? Do we need anything else adventure? This is victory poses. Ah, that's the battle pass one. That's the best one. Weapon charms don't care. Souvenirs don't care. I can dig that. I can dig that. I can dig that. I love that.
Nito. Nah, I think I can dig that. Yeah, that's alright, we've got it. I can dig that. Oh! Dude, look at this lump of gold! Look at this lump of gold! What? Oh my god! <laughs> okay, yeah. Um... That is... That is a gold weapon, alright. That that is a gold weapon. Holy cow! Yeah, I don't have I don't even have enough points for this, dude. I can't believe I played an entire season and I didn't have enough points for a single jade weapon. Damn rip! Right, who else has stuff? I have to make sure we filter for season ten. Skin? Oh, we saw Widowmaker skin. Uh, where was the? Was it a victory pose? Yeah, that was Bass Basso. Dude, that looks so freaking hot. I love that. That is really good. Anna, we've seen. Batiste, we've seen. Brig, we've seen. Anna didn't have multiple ones, did they? No. Iliari doesn't get anything? <gasps> Damn. Feels bad. Kiriko, we've seen. Kiriko's is so freaking cool, though, dude. I love this. I absolutely love this. And it's showing the gold because I think I've got the gold applied. I think if we remove the gold real quick. Hold up. Let's remove the gold. Then filter by season 10. Yeah, it looks a little bit more basic without the gold, but the gold really goes hard on this, dude. Yeah, gold goes hard. And then this. This thing right here. That is badass, dude. You can combine that with a new skin as well. Yeah, no, that's going to be awesome. Glare. Oh my god. No, don't glare at us. Okay. Right, hold up. Let me put my, my gold thing back on before I forget. There we go. Yeah, no, this skin. I, I'm definitely going to be picking this one up. 100%. Uh, Life Weaver. Highlight intro. Lucio. Mercy. Obviously, the mythic skin. Moira, victory pose we saw. Zen gets a skin as well. Ah, oh, that's actually kind of cool. That's actually kind of cool. He looks lethal. What? Blizzard not giving Kiriko a skin every season challenge? Impossible. I tell you what, there was a season where Kiriko got no skins. Was it no skins or no battle pass skins? There was a season. There was a season. Last season, she only got one, and it was a pink one. Was this season eight? No, season eight, she got festive. Uh oh, maybe maybe she did get a skin. Maybe she did get a skin. Wait, hold up. Chat, hold up. <laughs> hold up. Let me tell you something. No. <laughs> Let me tell you something. Uh, yeah, no, it, it, it looks like she has had something every single season. Okay, no, my bad. My, my bad. Oh! Oh! We found it! I told you there was a season. Season 4, she got fuck all. We got nothing. Look! Nothing! Season 4, I told you. That was a season. A, a single season. She has had some very good skins, though. She has had some very good skins. And, like, if, if, we, if we uncheck this and just leave it open... Yeah, she, she's got a few. <laughs> Damn. Is it Battle Pass skin? No, like most of these that we've been looking at have been, are going to be shop skins this season. All right, guys, quick reminder before I jump into the games here. This Cyclops skin, you can get this for free by watching Twitch streams for nine hours. It, it goes over like a whole week or, is it 15 days? I'm not entirely sure. Where's the dates? Where's the dates? Where were the dates? Uh, between Tuesday, April 16th to Sunday, April 21st. So it's, oh, until the end of the week. Until the end of the week. You need to tune in on Twitch to be able to get this free Roadhog skin, okay? Make sure you follow me on Twitch. And fuck it, let's go for it. Uh, one thing I want to do 
this season is I want to learn how to play fucking Mercy, dude. I, w I want to become a fucking Mercy main. I'm not even kidding. I'm not even kidding. Venture skins win at some point this season. I don't know. Have, have we... We haven't had leaks or anything about it, have we? Oh, we did get an image. There is an image. Okay. Right, let's go for it. We are becoming the Mercy main chat. Mercy parkour when? I've tried a little bit of Mercy parkour. I'm not very good at it. I need to learn, basically. Cooks with Mercy's mythic. Where was all that love on Hanzo's or Orissa's? I like Orissa's. I like it. I think, sure, Hanzo did get less than everyone else because he had less options. 100%. But even that shows in when you're going into... When you're going into the new mythic shop to buy them, Hanzo only has three levels, everyone else has four. Basically. Don't worry, I'll be right you're satisfied with Catboy Hanzo? Oh my god, no. I think I think everyone hates Catboy Hanzo. They ruined him. They ruined him. Now, chat. Uh, let me let me put a marker down. I need to figure out how the fuck to play Mercy. I have no idea. I have no idea, dude. None. I have absolutely no idea how to play her. So, it's going to be a case of... I think that one of the biggest issues I'm going to encounter is... is going to be... the counters to Mercy. You know, the dive heroes. People like fucking Genji. That kind of thing. Ah, also the freaking... the range at which you can go places. Oh, fuck. I'm dead. I'm dead. I'm dead. Maybe not. Uh, no, I'm bad. Yeah, we're dead. <laughs> yeah. Oh, dear. I'm not going to do very well. If you learn her movement, she's invisible. Yeah, I need to learn it, though. Like, how many... How much time do I have on her? Her profile, all modes, everything, time played. If I go down... I've played more than I thought. Eight hours. We have eight hours of mercy. We have eight hours on Mercy. Oh dear, everyone's dead. We have eight hours. Half of that is like custom games and shit. Half of that time is custom games. Uh, heals, heals. Oh, Lucio, careful. Get some damage boosting going. Careful. We good? Uh, shit, hold up. Wait, where's the freaking orb? Why can't I revive? Hello? Why can't I revive? Oh, because they're already back. Hmm, okay. Yeah, guys, we're gonna need to do a debrief after each of these matches and, like, of stuff we've learned. We're gonna have to, like, be like, we learned this during this match. Uh, junk crack. Be careful. Okay, we're not doing too bad. We're not doing too bad. Checkpoint respawn. Ah, that's what got it. That would be the one. Get him, get him, get him. Get him. No, get him. Shoot him, shoot him. Everyone shoot him. Everyone shoot the freaking tank. Uh, let me tell you something. Okay. Heals, please. Heals. Revive, nice. We did a thing, chat! We helped! We totally helped! We totally helped. You need to Overwatch on PC? It was on console, so any major differences? Uh, I wouldn't know because I've never played it on console, but I think, if anything, uh, expect, like, the... Expect roles to be slightly different. Or, like, the... Not roles. What am I saying? Uh, ranks. Expect ranks to be a little bit higher. Or, like, more difficult. Oh, I'm healing the wrong person, dude. I can't go in and try and get a... a what you call it? A revive. There ain't no way. Oh, yes. I want to damage boost that. Uh, oh, this is a risky res. Oh, fuck yes. 
Oh, okay, we got him. We got him. We got him. Come on, dude. Come on, dude. Come on. Come on. Stay alive for me. Nice. <laughs> Pacing a bit different. Lower ranks are also a bit different. Yeah, I think it would just be... It would be as if you're playing against slightly higher ranked players. I think that's about the only difference. Honestly, I've never played on freaking console, so I wouldn't be able to really tell you. Kyrie, Mercy, Elite? Um, I don't even think, like, Mercy is one of my favorite characters to play against, you know? I don't think she's one of my favorite characters to play against. Or with or against. Kiri and Iliari, I feel, is like a really good combo. Or who was the other one? Sorry, we got Varez. No, 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 no. Nice. We're, we're doing it right. I don't think we're doing too bad. Not bad, Mercy gameplay. I'm learning. I'm still learning. They don't really have dive characters, though. But I'm able to just exist. As soon as they get a Genji, I'm fucked. Uh, no. Fuck. Oh, no! I got taken out. Don't play Mercy. Trust. No, thank you. I want to play Mercy. In fact, I want to play Mercy so much that I'm going to main Mercy for this entire season. And I don't care. Another thing you need to learn is to not play Lucio Mercy. Ah, it's fucking quick play. It'll be fine, dude. You said watch you heavy when you play Blood Hunt on Twitch. Yeah, I we've got a Blood Hunt stream coming up actually soon. Very soon. Ne not this Friday, but next Friday. We've got a Blood Hunt stream. It's going to be a special um, two-year anniversary. The game is somehow still alive. I'm not entirely sure how, but I think it's mainly the freaking community. I died to the ultimate. That's my fault. Guys, is there a different voice line for when Venture uses it on our team versus uses it on their team? Or is it the same voice line? I get confused. And I don't know if it's me, you know, being stupid. Or if it's something else. There's a 2v1, dude. You do not want to be taking this. Shoot him. Shoot him. Shoot him. Just shoot him. Shoot him! Shoot him! Get him, get him, get him, get him. Oh, you used that so early. That Susie was very badly timed. Shoot the Reaper, shoot the Reaper, shoot the Reaper, shoot the Reaper. Yeah, oh, I'm gonna die. Yeah, there we go. We got the revive though. My bad. Oh, dear chap. Am I doing all right? 41% offensive, 59% healing. I think that's meant to be the other way around. Exact reason why Mercy's bad. No, that's not Mercy being bad. That's me being bad at Mercy. There's a difference there. Mercy isn't the problem. I am the problem. If I hadn't gone in for that res, I would have survived and we would have been fine. Like, we're still winning anyway. We're still winning. Uh, Don't get lifted up. We're good. Uh, we're kind of missing some people. Mm, ah, fuck. Again, movement. I don't have the movement down. Least biased bat player. Bat is really good on his own because he has like pre health bars. That's the most annoying part about bat. Down by one meter. That's all right. We can get that meter out. We've got loads of time yet. Loads of time. There we go. Nice. Uh, I need to get over. Why? Why are you in there alone? Oh my god, dude! What are you doing? What, what is everyone doing? Oh dear. Uh, do I need ult here? That's one ult. Oh shit! You got owned. I don't have res. I have 14 seconds. Oh dear. Get some distance from Reaper. Okay. Uh, yeah, you guys, you guys are pushing in like way fucking too deep. 
Oh, whoa. No, she came for me. They, they came for me. Damn it. Rest it depends on a lot on team positioning. Yeah, I actually saw that. Yesterday we did some community games and I had people physically looking out for me, trying to be in the right position at the right time. Uh, that was a bad res. Maybe not. Maybe this was a huge res. Oh, uh, never mind. <laughs> hey, we did something. We got the Lucio up. Lucio's doing something. Lucio's alive. I have my ult. I need to use it. I've been holding on to this for too long now. Wait, we went pharmacy? Uh-oh. Oh, no, we're scum. Chat, we're scum. Uh, okay. Everyone can have heals. Everyone can have damage. You need some help. Shit. You just die. Okay. Fuck you guys. Fuck you guys. Fuck you guys. Uh, res the tank. Res the tank. Did that work? Chad, we did the thing. I did the thing. We actually did a thing. Ah, shit. No, we're good. We're good. We're good. We're good. We're good. Look at this. Look at this bitch. Look at this bitch. Nice. We did a thing. Come on, chat. Was that a good play? Like, I did a thing. Oh, yeah. That, I did not mean to go that far forwards. Did not mean to go that forwards. If I play more in the air and less on the ground, easier to survive. Yeah. If I can figure out how to do that more, uh, we can definitely try that. Nice. Oh, can we get the, the freaking supports? Can we get supports? Did we run off? We fucking C9'd, dude. We C9'd! We C9'd so hard. Shit. Oh, no. Uh, Pre-Lim 7 deaths, 14 assists. How do we do? I, I literally have no idea. Like, I felt like I did alright, I guess. Part of kids kids knowing when to switch to Moira. Mm. Yeah, I know, I know like the Mercy mains, the proper Mercy mains have been playing a lot of Moira recently. Like apparently Mercy is not very good in me, like last season and this season. But I, I think that at my skill level, I don't think it's gonna make a difference too much, honestly. Once Mercy switches to her pistol, she loses out on a time she could be using her staff. Yeah, okay, so here, here's the way I think of this, okay? Here is the way I think of this. Let me get this set up so I can draw again. So, Mercy. Mercy has either healing or damage. With the healing, you're basically sustaining another target. So your, your DPS, your DPS is basically just surviving. Therefore, DPS does more damage. Okay. Option number two. Mercy also has her damage boost. So your DPS can do more damage. Now, there's a secret option number three where Mercy also has... Mercy also has her pistol. And the pistol means that you take your DPS, your original DPS damage... You add in your damage, and it's basically this times two. And that, this number right here, is bigger than the more damage there. Right? Big brain moment. Massive brain moment. If you can both shoot someone, that damage is more than a damage boosted on one person. That's not big brain. You killed your tank. Wait, no, the tank wasn't even in the equation. Tank isn't here. Tank is gone. We're, we're shooting other people. Forget the tank. The tank is fine. The tank will be fine. 
Because if we kill the enemy team, the tank doesn't need to tank anymore. You see? And we're smart. We're being very smart. You see, it's ball anyway. Ball is fine. Ball is fine. Uh, who should I... I don't... Hmm. I think I'm meant to be pocketing people, right? I think that's how this works. Oh, where is she? You see what I mean? Oh, come on. I almost got that. Damn. Okay. Well, I revived one. Damn. The Ash is good. Make sure to boost her. Mm. Talking about... Oh, last game. Oh, last game is fine. Yeah, no. I haven't got much time on Mercy. We're going to do some shit things. We're going to do some stupid things. And we're going to start figuring out that, yeah, I need to stop doing whatever the shit things are. So that we can do more good things. Oh, I need uppies. I need uppies. Hello? Oh, uh, well, let's just revive instead. Oh, where have they gone? There we go. Damage boosting Ash. Whoa! Oh, I fucked up. I fucked up. Oh, we need to get rid of that freaking whatchamacallit, dude. I might need a different button, actually, for switching weapon. I feel like that's not working, ideally. On quick play? Yeah, I, I will probably play a lot of quick play this season. Like, I like to take... I like to take uh, rank seriously. So, if I do go into ranked, it's because either I feel like I have learned how to play Mercy enough. Ah, no, I flew the wrong way. How does D.Va get a quad kill with that, dude? What are my team doing? Oh, I went around the corner and up over the top? What? Bruh. Hope everything's good. Just gonna have your stream on while you mark assignments. No worries, dude. What do you teach? I've got a friend who's a teacher up in Paris. He's a history teacher. And the thing is, it's turned him extreme right wing by teaching in Paris. <laughs> I don't I don't want to go into the whole political thing. Oh, that was too late. But yeah, it's turned him extreme right wing. Uh hello? Uh, okay. More damage. Yeah! You can get a revive. You can die. You can die. Ah, uh, reloads. Rip. You can have some heals. And straight back into the damage. Get him, get him, get him, get him, get him. Come on, come on, shoot him, shoot him, shoot him. I know he's reflecting, but shoot him anyway. Shoot him anyway. It's fine. Ah, uh, get closer! Okay, if you press shift a second time, it cancels. Ah! That's what's fucking me up, because I'm panic pressing shift to try and fly. You see? Double damage! Double damage! Ah, uh, did we give a res? No way you got me from there. What? Damn, someone shot that reflect. That was not helping. Not like a new game mode because of people. I haven't tried it yet. That's going to be something we're going to have to get into today at some point. Shit, Ash is dead. Uh, let's not take that, please. Oh, I don't have it. Uh, two seconds. You can walk back. We don't need it yet. Oh, I switched to Reaper anyway. Mm, okay. Extra damage. You see? If we can double the damage, we're going to be fine. Why did I stand on the spot? Get him, get him, get him, get him. Get him, get him, get him! Ah. You can have some heals, you can have some damage. You can have some heals. You're dead. Uh, I don't know if I can get up there, actually. 
no 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 how did Venture get up there so quick? To oh, they were going up the stairs. That's fine. Err. Computer science. Nice. I did a little bit of computer science, but it was like really, really early. Not early days, but early on in like the educational cycle. So it didn't really teach you anything. I think that's like some of the only freaking diplomas I actually have. Like in IT. Nice. Echo's a really good person to boost! Holy shit! That is a Reaper. I don't want to be next to the Reaper. Please. Okay. Fuck it. Uh-oh. Oh, uh, did I just res him into a death? No, we're good. We're good. We're good, we're good, we're good. Shoot him, shoot him, shoot him, shoot him. Ah, oh, dude, I'm trying to... I'm trying to shoot people. I'm trying to heal people. I think I need to play around with the sensitivity in a sec. Because, like, I'll be looking at someone, and I'm trying to get the beam to attach, and it's going on to someone else. So, I think if I reduce the sensitivity of that, it should be a little bit more accurate. That might actually help, I think. Why does Cyclic Roadhog have three eyes? That was for the April Fool's update. People were guessing googly eyes on top of their skins. Just for shits and giggles. But the thing was, they didn't take into account that Roadhog Cyclops is meant to only have one eye. Oh, you have no sleep? That fucks. Get him, get him, get him, get him, get him! Nice! You're fine, you're fine, okay. We got you, nice! Uh, minefield, yeah, no way these guys are surviving. Shoot Vianna, shoot Vianna, shoot Vianna. Mm, is anyone actually gonna contest this? Oh, I can't remember. Can Venture contest while under? I think they can. Oh, okay, never mind. To better aim his hook. <laughs> hey, if you if you had three eyes, you'd make the most of it, right? Oh damn, yeah, I got absolutely lasered. So I think one of the things I need to figure out, and this is probably something we'll just end up doing throughout today, is like who are who are some of my my mortal enemies? Who do I really need to watch out for? Yeah, I didn't mean to go forwards. My bad. My bad. That's my bad movement. There's going to be a lot of that, the accidental bad movement. Where is that Samra? Mmm, careful, dude. Yeah, you see, it didn't hook onto the freaking ball. It hooked onto Moira, who wasn't even freaking in my line of sight, dude. Come on, Diva. Bring it. What are you gonna do? What are you gonna do? Get him, get him, get him. Uh, maybe heal. We can keep the teammates alive and also shoot, then we're doing well. No, I can't fly. I can't fly when that happens. Panic. Panic. Diving DPS Moira's as well. Mm, there's going to be a lot. I think Genji has been like my biggest annoyance in previous Mercy sessions, basically. If you fly to them and hit S in space, you fly backwards automatically. Yeah, that, that's just the kind of thing I need to get used to. Like, I, I know how to do that kind of stuff. It's just I need to practice it more. This is a quad kill. This got literally our entire team, dude. I hate how you don't see it, though. I think the player of the game should follow the bomb, not the diva's point of view. Uh, right, guys, give me like five seconds. I need to quickly run to the bathroom. I'm going to fill up my drink and I'll be right back. If you got any mercy tips though, pop them in, pop them in chat. I'll read them in a sec.
10 seconds. Ah, oh, balls, I got kicked out. Shit, my bad. It's always when I go out to pee that the queues are really, really fast. Annoyingly. Ever since you messed with your adventure sensitivity, you've not been able to play any of the other projectile here. Oh, really? Damn, the queues are getting faster. I want to have a look at my sensitivity for mercy. I think there's an option I need to change. Let's insta-lock Mercy. Let's show our domination by doing that. Show that we're, we're now a Mercy one trick. Uh, beam sensitivity. Is it that? I think I need to reduce this. Let's try 75. Toggle. Ah. Oh my god. Oh Dear God, there are a lot of options for this. If I toggle Guardian Angel, I think if I turn that off, let's try it actually. If I, uh, novice, if I turn that off. Oh yeah, no, it's just like instant. Okay, so yeah, I need that on. Or, okay, no, let's try it with off. It means I have to hold it, but I think that might actually be better. I need to find some scarcity guides, dude. I'm not even kidding. Mm, I don't know. Toggle feels better to me. It feels better. Oh, yeah, no. Toggle, 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 toggle. Toggle. <laughs> there we go. That's way better. Who are we shooting? You can live. You can die. You good? You good there, Sajron? Get him, get him, get him. Viviana, Viviana. Nice. I'm getting into tapping spacebar as well. I remember seeing that somewhere where tapping spacebar means that you can still fly, but that basically when you are flying, you you don't have your wings out, which means you're a smaller target, basically. Nice. I don't think I'm doing too bad, though. All things considered, I think this could totally be worse. Like, way worse. Yeah, you were dead, dude. There's nothing I'm going to do about that. There is nothing I'm going to do about that. I love the movement, though. I wish Mercy was like a freaking DBS. Ah, uh, no, Venture's dead. Whoa! Not the sleep! Ah, uh, no, I'm screwed. Back! How are we doing so far? Pre-kills? We have more kills than our DPS and our tank. <laughs> As a new Overwatch season, haven't played since RAM was added. Oh shit, there's been a lot of really good changes. Overwatch have, like, quite honestly, been on a, a really good roll of adding and changing a bunch of stuff, dude. I'm not even kidding. Mm, okay, let's pop this. Uh, you escaped, for now. Nice. Oh. Nope. No, you got back in the mech! Immediately destroyed again. Right, we're good. What does this do, like, Mercy, please? Dude, we are winning! Are we not winning? 
What is it with Overwatch people and complaining when they're winning? What is it with that? Okay, we got a tank. We good? Okay. Might give it another go. Oh, do it. Do it. There's a lot of really good changes. A lot of really good changes. I can't like remember off the top of my head. But yeah, definitely worth playing. 100%. All can survive. Oh, come on, dude. Come on, dude. Ah, no. We got that res. Nice. Ah, I got hit with that. Fuck. Can we get cleanse. We probably don't need it, actually. Thank you. Ah, no! They got our Kiriko. Nice. I don't have res. I don't have res. I need to watch out for that. Okay. Hey, Winton. How you doing, dude? Winton, did you see the... Uh... Oh, fuck. We're dead. Yeah. I don't think there was anything I could do there. Did you see the Winton in the Battle Pass? Hop between Warframe and Destiny 2. That's interesting that you play both. I don't... I wouldn't say, like, both of those games are compatible with each other. Just because of, like, how much of a grind each is at the same time, right? Okay, live, 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 live. Kiriko, live. We good? That, what was that, Suzu? And then people are like, mercy, please. Like, fuck off. Like, actually. I got you, buddy. I got you. Oh, you just got antied very hard. Oh, God. Yeah. Bring it, bitch. Bring it. Bring it. Bring it. Bring it. You won't. You're too scared. Come back here. Come back. Oh, my God. Dude. Okay. We're doing it. We're doing it. Did that again about your comment with... Oh, TikTok crash shit. Uh, basically, I don't think... Or, like, off the top of my head, just, like, looking at it, it doesn't feel like Warframe and Destiny 2 are, like, compatible with each other. Like, to play at the same time, like, hop in between something. Because it feels like both games require so much time to freaking farm, right? It feels like they need... They take so much time from you. Uh, who else do we need? There we go. Oh, no. Come on. Bring it, bring it, bring it, bring it, bring it. Nice. Do a Reaper. Not so much. You do raise Friday weekend and Warframe most of the week. You stop playing. Okay, fair enough. Fair enough. It, it just sounds like on the surface because they're two very big grind orientated games, right? Oh, uh, you used Suzu way too soon, buddy. Fuck. Our Kiriko is not doing amazing. Who the fuck was saying Kiriko, please? Oh, it was the enemy support saying Mercy, please. Okay, that makes way more sense. I thought it was one of my teammates. Never mind. We've literally got the enemy support. Like, I have 2,900 damage with Mercy. This is why, like, I tend to have more healing beam usage, because, like, I'm either healing or trying to damage. Rather than, like, necessarily damage boosting. If that makes sense. Okay. That can die. Did we get that? We did. <laughs> Meteor is gone! No, dude! Oh no, dude. The poor enemy team. 
the poor enemy team. Oh no. Stop playing Warframe as much when the final shape comes out for Destiny 2. Fair enough. I've always been someone who who struggles to like jump between different games. I'm very much someone who will play like one game and it'll be like absolutely balls of a wall deep doing everything for that one game. Uh, they have robots. It's probably not worth me trying to res anything here, right? Yo, oh, fuck. Yeah, no, I'm dead. Unless... Yeah, no, I'm very dead. Uh, uh, unless... Unless... <laughs> nice. Let's go. Sh movement. Oh, no. That was a huge, huge Suzu. That almost actually worked. That almost worked. Play Destiny 2 Rainbow Six Warframe Remnant Tomb. You'll be playing Celebrate when it's out. And Final Fantasy 16 DLC. Fuck me. Yeah, I play Overwatch and Warframe. And I need to... I want to play more of the finals. I just don't have fucking time, dude. It's like, I don't know how people find the time to play so many things. I guess you play, like, something for half an hour and then switch, right? Okay, we've got Moira. We no longer have Suzu. And our tank is dead. What are the odds? Chat? Ah, oh, no! No, 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 no! I was gonna try and use the orb so I could parkour off. Ah, damn, the orb disappeared. You work nights to sort of? Yeah, that's fair. Yeah, my work is, like, all over the place. Like, I'm self-employed, so most of the time my work schedule is, like, it, sometimes I work, sometimes I don't. Kind of just depends on which freaking work sites I've got, who I'm working for, or who I'm working with. But I do a, a lot of subcontracting. Oh god, dude, you're you're gonna die very quickly if you're not careful. All right, so this right here, prime case, where freaking shooting the tank is gonna be giving me more value than fucking damage boosting, right? Because I'm literally almost doubling the damage output rather than plus 30%. Oh, don't die, don't die, don't die. Ah! Ouch! My tushy! Okay, yeah, that hurt, and they now have checkpoint. That's fine. Uh, no shit if you're self-employed. Yeah, it's, uh, it can be difficult. Like, the problem is... As much as, like, I enjoy it, the problem is, if I don't work, I don't get paid. Like, today, I'm not earning any money. Right now, I'm not earning fuck all money. I mean, like, other than people watching ads on Twitch, basically, which isn't huge. It's not huge. Who are we shooting? Who are we shooting? We good? Nice, we got him. But yeah, so it can be, it can be up and down all over the place. 4,700 damage, 12 kills. I don't think that's too bad. I'm still doing more healing than damage. But yeah, it can, it can be all over the place. It can be very stressful at times, but I just don't like other people telling me what the fuck to do. Mercy man, I am now. I I wasn't. I wasn't before. I've just started. I have like eight, eight hours on Mercy, basically. Give the finals a go, didn't really click. Lost all your love for shooter games. I love the finals. Like, it, it scratches... Like, I don't know if I've got ADHD. Or if I just kind of, like, vibe a little bit with that sort of... You know, must have everything moving and exploding all, the same time, all at the same time. But... It, it scratches that part of my brain where, like, it's utter chaos all of the time. And especially, like, as a light main. Where you, you want movement, you want action, you want all that kind of stuff. Uh, I enjoy it. I really do enjoy it a lot. The problem is, obviously, trying to create content. I'm, I'm trying to combine the games I enjoy playing and the games I want to create content around, basically. How do you handle mental physique? Uh, what do you mean? Like, uh, mental health? I'm not sure I understand the question. But yeah, no, I enjoy the finals. I really do. This is another really good skin, by the way, guys. This Widow skin right here, I love this. I actually love that skin. 
Mo has no mental health. Yeah, if you just delete, you go into the files, delete the file that says mental health, and then, you know, it can't be corrupted. It can't go bad if you don't have a file. You know? Uh, right, I think this is one of these spots where having a boost on Widowmaker, at least for this opening bit, is going to help. This is dope skin, though. I love that. M underscore health dot DLL. Yes. Delete. Get rid of it. Oh, yes. Dude. We are mercying. We are finally mercying. Here we go. Right, let's actually try and do something, though. Uh, we good? Okay, nice. You can live. Oh. Where'd she go? Down there. Okay, we're good. Shoot, 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 shoot. Yeah, come on, Arissa. Come on. Come on, buddy. We got this. Dude, I actually really enjoy playing Mercy. I don't care what anyone says. I'm probably playing Mercy really poorly as well, by the way. Like, it's not a case of I'm carrying the game or anything. This is just fun. Oh, the headshot noises. Yeah, I'm trying. I am trying. I think she got ult. She does. That's good. I got you. I got you. Oh, go for it. Go for it. Go for it. Do 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 it. Nice. Let's go, bitch. There we go. You see, I'm able to see these kind of calls. I knew what was going to happen there because I've mained Arissa. I knew exactly what that Arissa wanted to do. She needed to stay alive and wanted to get a damage boost. And I was just like, yeah, guys, okay, let's go for it. Y you need so much time in this fucking game mode to start understanding that kind of stuff. So much. Uh, I need to not die, please. You can live. You can die. Uh, Arissa, come back. Nice. Hey, Leon, how you doing? Looks like a streamer to say hi to. Um, I don't know about that. I don't know if I'm a friendly streamer. Oh, I got pushed back. Ah! Whoa, I was in the air. Okay, so that, that ability does kind of come up from the floor a little bit. Just a little bit. Not a huge amount, but I need to watch out for that. So you doing videos on Warframe? You've seen the recent ones then. I've only been playing for about two months. I've got a whole fucking series of content that I'm planning. I'm actually really happy with like the, the ideas and stuff I'm coming up with. Uh, okay. Ah, no, I tried it. <laughs> uh, you playing Rag? No, I'm learning how to play Mercy. We're just doing a quick play. But I'm not a very good Mercy player. Finish most of the quests in the game. Nice. Yeah, I think I'm like halfway through, I guess. I don't know. I don't know how close I am to, you know, actually being done. Come on, Arissa. Come on. Behind you. Behind you. Watch out for this bitch. Oh, no, I got trapped. I got trapped. I got trapped. We're, we're all going to die. We're all going to die. We're all going to die. We're all gonna die. No, I'm just a poor Mercy player. Leave me alone. Oh dear. What rank am I? I'm about plat. I think I finished plat three last season. So hard to find content. Really? What kind of content do Warframe players normally look for? Because that kind of information would really help out, right? Because I, I'm just getting into it. And some of my, my playthroughs, while at first were like all over the place, I had no idea what the fuck I was doing. I feel like we've got some kind of... Like, some kind of plan now. Where we didn't have that before. I got you. I got you, don't worry. Uh, I think Tank needs my help, though. Yeah, I got you. Get him, get him, get him. Ah, no! Woo. 
Risky res? Oh, go for it. Go for it, Arissa. Go for it. Do it. Do it. Do it. Come on, Arissa. You got this. Shoot them. I don't want to shoot them. I literally don't want to shoot these guys. So I, I, I've got to be freaking these guys. You just deal with these. <laughs> We're good? We're rolling this team. We're doing all right. We are doing all right. Uh, fuck. Oh, no. Okay, that was a bad res. My bad. Most of the time is built and or farming tutorials for specific resources, but people enjoy watching playthroughs from what I know. Yeah, my playthroughs have been doing pretty well. Like, quite honestly, the out of all the content I've been doing, at least recently, my Warframe content has been doing the best. The best out of everything, so... I'm gonna try and do like a whole month or two, just like absolutely focusing on on doing Warframe as much as possible and see where it takes me. We'll see. But yeah, one of the one of the series I'm trying to make at the moment, and again, like this is a whole fucking story just to be able to unlock the right stuff I need for the freaking videos, right? But I want to do like early builds or beginner builds for for different Warframes. Oh, I got trapped. Fucking rip. Ah. Recent tutorial has been terrible. And like uh, almost 30 subscribers, no supporters. Like it's a nine. Ah, oh, dude. When, when you're a content creator, your first videos, when you're starting out, they're all going to be terrible. That is just a thing. It will be terrible. Learn from it. Just try and make each video a little bit better. And if you continue to sustain the a little bit better each time thing, then in in six months, in a year, in whatever, then yeah, you're going to have really good videos or better videos, right? Ah, oh, you're behind the ball. Okay, let's do this. You can heal. Oh, no, dude. No, 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 no. I went too far away. I flied out of the range of freaking res, dude. Oh, my God. Oh, dear. 1.2k on one of your most recent videos regarding lore. Uh, look into doing shorts as well. Short form content is really good, especially when like you're trying to get discovered. Ah, fuck. Damn. Rip. We did all right in the first part of that match. We really did all right. I'm sure I can actually pull out a couple clips from that. Our tank was doing all right. Oh, they're Bastion though. 11,000 damage. Damn. Even thumbnail was funny. Yeah, the, the thing with thumbnails is you kind of have to think from a viewer's point of view. Like, what is going to stop them from scrolling down? Like, as you're scrolling through YouTube, what's going to make them stop scrolling? And it's generally going to be... Like, what I've tried doing with some of my thumbnails recently... Uh, let me show you through some of these. Is stuff like... Here's Teshin. And, like, Teshin looks evil. And then, like, the title accompanies it. But you're scrolling down, and it's like, hold up, that's Teshin, but he's, like, all red. That kind of thing, right? Or, like, spooky stuff. It's, like, something that gets you to stop. You do TikToks and short. Oh yeah, absolutely. Like if you if you are making short form content, post it to to all the platforms, everywhere. Don't don't limit yourself to just posting to TikTok or Shorts. See the thumbnail. Uh, I will tell you what, dude. Uh, in in Discord, go to channels and roles and make sure you have got the content creation thing. And we've got a little we've got a little tab somewhere. Where is it? Content creators, creator chat. We, we need to get more people in here, but I, I want these channels to be like for exactly that, right? Where you can go through and ask people's opinions and showcase a few bits and pieces. Again, like the whole thing isn't for like self-promotion, but if you if you guys want to talk about thumbnails and maybe like some tips and bits and pieces and you want to showcase something that you've made and ask a question, then you are sure. Absolutely. Go for it. 
Don't really use Discord for some personal reasons. Oh, fair enough. Fair enough. Uh, Discord's like basically what I fucking live on. Really. It's what I live on. I'm running an experiment at the moment as well. And I can't tell you guys why I'm running the experiment or what the experiment's for yet. Because otherwise it would break the experiment. But... Uh, basically, we are currently bidding in Discord or on the Discord channel on on one of my... What is it? It's a genetic imprint for my first pet. It's only one of them, and someone pointed out later on that, like, two of them would have been better. But, hey. Uh, left click, left click. Yeah, make him deal with herself. Yeah! Come on, Diva. Do it, do it, do it, do it. Mm, yeah, I need to heal, don't I? Ah, I got pulled down. No! Ah, I got sucked off. Damn. Up for some community games later on. Not today. We had community games yesterday. I need to plan another, like, stream or something for community games. I'm mostly a solo player. That's what I enjoy doing the most. Oh, fuck. Whoa, what am I getting stuck on? Ah, damn, well played. What, what is that in chat? The fuck is that? Zero, 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 just a little bit too slow. Mm. Oh, get him, get him, get him, get him, get him, get him. Get him, mate. Where do you go, this? Get him! We're good. Get a tracer. Nice. Yeah, you see, this is one of the things uh, I'm going to be doing as I play Mercy. And um, this is probably not necessarily the right way. But I'm going to be one of these guys who's just, like, not afraid to pull out the fucking Barbie Blaster, okay? Uh, okay. Yeah, no, you get revived. Oh, I died immediately afterwards. Dude, this hero's strong! Uh, why didn't it heal May? Because May has an ice block that May can just pop and survive and live. Whereas if I was damage boosting the Mei, then Mei would still be gaining something. Have I played the new mode? Not yet, no. That's something I need to go through a little bit later. Yeah. Okay, well, let's have this for a sec. Get him, get him, get him, get him. You guys have got them, right? Oh, just fucking shoot them in the head. There we go. Dear God, dude. Oh, he got nanoed as well. Yeah. Oh, no. 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 Diva, live. Live. We're going to need someone to go to point low. Uh, Diva's got it. Diva has died, though. Or Dime. Oh, what a pin! Nicely done. Nicely done. According to internet, it's very fast. That might be right up my street, then. It's open queue, right? It's in... Whatchamacallit? Oh, come on. That was my ankles. Nah, that's bullshit. That is bullshit. Ah, oh, no, Life Weaver. Damn. Getting your tutorials to shorten attention span people. Those are less than four minutes, so realistically, it should be more attention. In theory, yes, but good retention doesn't necessarily mean fast editing. That the two can be completely different. Look at someone like Mark Rober. Mark Rober's series on the fucking... Whatchamacallum? Uh, Squirrel Olympics. Backyard Squirrel Maze. 
Squirrel, squirrely limp, squirrely Olympics. That, watch that. But watch it and look at the editing and the pacing and stuff. It's not quick cuts and stuff. It doesn't need quick cuts. You don't need quick cuts for good retention. There are so many other methods and techniques and stuff you can use. You don't have to cater it to like stupidly quick editing and short attention spans. Uh, right, I'm down here with no one to go to. Ah, my God! Thank you. Oh my god, yeah, we just got absolutely owned. Do this a shield now? I think that might be in the fancy mode. They've come out with a new experimental mode. And I think it's just for, like, shits and giggles. It's a temporary mode. And the abilities in there have been changed. I don't know if that's one of the changes or if that's the... Wait, did Doomfist have a shield? No, he didn't for the April Fool's thing, did he? It wasn't the April Fool's one. So yeah, maybe Doomfist does have a shield. I don't know. We haven't been that far yet. Oh my god. Dude, piss off. Please. We need Life Weaver back, please. Mm, okay. We got you. We got you. Oh, what a pull. Nicely done, Life Weaver. I feel like we want to push out of here, though, if we can. This would be a good time to do so. Ah, oh, fuck. I got one of them. Damn, they're getting their ult so fast. So fast. And if you send a thumbnail on Twitter, uh, try it. I generally don't use Twitter for like DMs and stuff. I generally just use it to like comment under other accounts and bits and pieces. Not something I really look at. This is why we have a Discord. It's like the whole community thing. I don't really have that community sort of aspect on other platforms, I don't feel like. Did you just use your shield for nothing? You did. Whoa! Dear Lord, there we go. Uh, hello? Ram? Oh, who's getting hammered down? Oh! <gasps> what a pull! Dude, this life leader. Guys, remind me to fucking endorse this life leader. Absolutely fucking carrying. Absolutely carrying. Go on, live, 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 live. An enemy does what? <laughs> An enemy comes, he says. Oh my god. Damn. Said it awesome. I, d I don't know if I have a time to look through that at some point. I have to remember. Uh, what are these guys doing? You can piss off. Dude, I tell you what I I almost won with Mercy is a freaking like one but like left click for this, right click for something else for like damage boost, and then another button for freaking pistol, and then there'd be no switching between weapons, right? What? I'm sorry. How? Is this what people have been saying when they said Mercy needs a fucking nerf? Or a buff? What was that? The world's fucking strongest hammer. It went up there. Shit, can we get a clip on that, guys? Please? A Twitch clip? That one might be good to share on Twitter. That's the kind of thing that Twitter's good for. That's the thing it's great for. They're just down here. Help! 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 Okay. <laughs> Venture. I need to figure out how to take on Venture. Does Kiesi already have videos out of that? We might have to go and watch some videos. It might be a good time to have lunch as well. Half 12. We could check out some videos on like how to counter certain things as Mercy. Because I have no idea. I generally don't watch tutorials either. I'm normally better off, you know, just playing and figuring it out myself. Even if that overall takes longer. Right, come on, guys. Live, 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 live. Oh my god. I'm trying to keep you alive. 
I really am. I'm trying. Oh my god. This guy is getting fucking trolled. Oh yeah, no, we're fucked. Oh my god. Yeah, we're getting rolled. We're getting rolled, guys. I have a thousand damage. It's something. It's something. Uh, who's not carrying the weight? Ah, bitch. I was gonna say which one of our TPS was doing slightly better. See if we can pocket them a little bit. So I've been trying to keep the tank alive, but I think as Mercy, you kind of almost want to... You almost want to focus on the DPS, right? More than anything else. This is Life Weaver, though. Life Weaver did amazing. Honor and glory. Look, look at it. Okay, watch this fucking hammer. Watch the hammer. Oh, I wasn't now. It was before. Right. I'll tell you what, we'll do another one. Ah, oh, maybe two, because then I could time it with one of my girlfriend as well. Because I need I need to take a break for eating food at some point. At some point. What are we doing in Battle Pass? What do we actually have? Realistically, tutorials on Warframe are just how to farm stuff easy, not really faster. It's better faster. Yeah, that's fair. That's fair. So, like, one of the things I'm going to go through is I'm trying to create, like, a whole fucking series of, like, early game builds. And where is my text file here? Hmm... This one, early game builds. And basically, like, I'm, I'm creating a whole fucking list of how I want to make the series. And it might take me a little bit longer to actually figure out exactly how I want to make it. But once I've got the framework for that series down, I'll be able to just copy and paste the framework onto different Warframes. And every single time, I'll just be able to make the new build. The problem is, at the moment, I have like seven Warframes that are building. I think they're going to be ready all tomorrow. So then I'll have to use them level them up then i'll have to figure out how we want to build it then at that point then i can figure out what weapons what mods and stuff we need like what is complementary to that build then at that point figure out where where to farm everything and then from there once we've done everything then then i can make everything then we can make the videos shatter got buffed oh we should go through the fucking patch notes huh Oh, hell yes. Wait, no! I want it to be up. I want it to be up. Do we have a Oh, we've got a line of sight to the doors. They're going to be right in the middle there. You watch. You watch this, chat. Get out of my way, Life Weaver. Get out of my way. Yes, there we go. <laughs> oh, can we get anything? If we can get rid of pylons, at least, that would work. Yeah, doom. Careful. If I can try and heal doom when he's blocking, I think that'd work out pretty well. Because that's kind of where doom wants his health, right? Oh, dude. Oh, I was looking for someone to fly to. That's my bad. So you can try and make a new account for fun and videos. Go for it. Why not? Why not? I've been enjoying playing through the story. But you, you only really get to do that once, right? You only get to play through the story once. It's like the second time you play through it, it's not quite the same. And especially like if ever if ever someone was to fake like going through it the first time viewers know that kind of shit straight off it's why i've spent so much time and so much effort trying to fucking uh avoid spoilers for bits and pieces i don't think that was meant for me actually ah uh, fuck where is he there he is okay Story still ongoing. Yeah, I kind of figured, like, with some of the updates and stuff we're getting. Why? I was fine. Just wasted life grip, dude. Well, we're already into counter watch. Oh, uh, fuck. There's a 
somewhere somewhere why why would you do that uh, we probably didn't need both of those alts but I think we just had the same idea at the same time uh, go for it Ryan or, or or not okay I'll, I'll go for it we shall do the shooting Ah, uh, she got bubbles. Rip. Let me get it. There we go. <laughs> nice. Is Warframe PvE? Yeah, PvE. There, I think there is like a small PvP section in there, but it's not what the game is based on. Couldn't connect. Uh oh, TikTok, have you have you disconnected? Oh, I can't heal that. I can't heal you when you're underground. All right, hold up. Oh no! All right, hold up. I need to check real quick. What is going on with TikTok? Are you fine, guys? Uh, TikTok chat. Can you confirm if the stream's actually working? It said couldn't connect, but I don't know if it's just like being a nincompoop. Oh, I can't help you from there. Way too far away. Ah, shit. My bad. You said you were playing the game on a new account for a new ultimate goal? Sure, but like the reason why people watch playthroughs, or at least in my opinion, right, is because you get the reactions to like the, these... Um, what's the word I'm looking for? There are some missions which are just so well known within the community that everyone's like, oh, yeah, a new, a new war? Is it a new war? Or whatever that fucking mission is. I forget the names of them now. But, like, when you say, I'm going to be playing through this mission for the first time, you know that at a certain time during that mission, you're going to have a huge plot twist. And everything is going to be thrown on his head. And I think people enjoy watching someone else go through that for the first time. And you just don't have that same kind of thing when you're going through a second time. Sure, like, there can be other motives. I'm sure, like, because in half of the freaking missions, there have been... Oh my god, dude, 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 dude. Thank you. Why is no one shooting the fucking Echo, dude? We literally got one person behind us. Okay. We good? We needed to get rid of that fucking echo, dude. Yeah, I know through many of the missions, there was like multiple options in like as you're playing through. Ah, dear. And I'm almost sure that if you were to play through and only pick on like the dark options or only pick on the light options, that would probably actually be something somewhat important to the game. Why can I not go to this person? Dude, I've been trying to go to that person for like the last five minutes. Come on, let's get one of them alive at least. There we go. We got one. There we go, nice. Uh, oh dear. Dude, Ryan, you're so far in there! What are you doing? Oh my god. Average Ryan pressing W key. Shit. Do a series on Excalibur only or specific Warframes only? Yeah, sure. Or maybe you could do like a Nuzlocke. I don't know whether a Nuzlocke would work. Oh shit. Oh, that's alright, we've got the tree. Alright, so I'm gonna just burst through that. Uh we're good, we're good, we're good. We can heal here. Damage boost. Many damages. Many damages. Oh no! No! Ah, oh, we got stuck. Bam. Looks like an awesome goal, like Mastery Grand 3, actually do really good. What do you mean though? Like, uh, 
trying to complete a mastery 30 in a certain time frame or mastery rank mastery rank is oh that takes fucking forever though isn't it or mastery rank speed run maybe story related replays don't do well oh dude my my story related replays oh i suppose first play rather than replay but yeah but those have been doing really well Very well for me. Well, I say very well. Like, it's a couple a couple thousand views. Like, it's not crazy or anything, but compared to the other content that I have been doing, they've been doing very well. Oh, shit. I can't get up there, dude. Go for it. Go for it. Go for it. Grab a damage boost. Shoot him. Shoot him. Shoot him. If he's dead, he can't kill us. Thank you! Winking at him as well. Nuzlocke, yes, that's it, Shaden. So basically, a Nuzlocke is... I think it originates from a Pokemon challenge, where you would play through Pokemon, but every time you would lose, a, or every time... We got play of the game! What? Oh, this was a time where we just needed to kill them, right? No one was shooting the Idiari. Oh, yeah, and then we got the, the freaking... <laughs> Get wrecked! Mercy play again. Dude, absolutely awesome gameplay. I love Mercy. <laughs> you can time it too if you like. Yeah, I guess. Ah, oh, dude, I'm loving this. Right, hold up. Hold up, hold up. I need to... We need to figure some things out. Because right now, one of the things that I'm struggling with is Venture is getting me very easily so i don't know if skiesti has done one of these uh when a mercy player plays venture mm, what do you have skiesti do you have for us did you do a playing against No, not by the looks of it. Okay. Um. Thoughts, chat. I actually want to save. I want to save the mercy play of the game. I'm trying to figure out how can I avoid dying so much to venture because venture has been an issue for me so far, and we're gonna have to make like a whole fucking list. In fact, do I have? I have a, a button for this. Uh, problematic. Okay, and then can we get, can we remove people from this? Uh, I think I need to create a new tier, don't I? How do I create a new tier? Uh, add a row below. Okay. Here we go. So, this is just for, you know, so I can help visualize it myself. This isn't like a, an actual tier list. But what I need to do, or what I want to do, is create a list of problematic heroes. Like, people I really need to watch out for. People who I'm going to have to learn how to counter. Or write heroes who are like, you know, a little bit, let's say, annoying heroes rather than anything. Annoying heroes and then people who I can ignore. So anyone who's hit scan is going to be annoying, right? Because they're just going to be able to shoot me out of the sky. And then people who I can ignore, I guess. Who can we ignore? Can we fill some of these in already? Just to give me somewhat of like a an overview. Uh, who else is going to be really annoying? Cass is going to be... Cass is going to be annoying rather than anything, because I think Cass is... Like, his distance isn't going to really help. Like, his damage fall off. Something like this. Genji, definitely problematic. May we can probably fucking ignore. Ryan, we can probably ignore, I guess. Cass is problematic. 
But his range, though, his range sucks balls. That's what I mean. So, like, problematic are going to be, like, really difficult to deal with heroes. Annoying are going to be, like, the ones who are going to be going for me, but, you know, they're not as bad. Like, Sojourn might actually go up into problematic because her railgun. And then ignore. Like, who can I ignore? Like, I can almost ignore Brick, right? I can almost ignore other Mercy players. Anyone who's got super slow projectiles is going to help. Moira is going to be annoying. Uh, Tracer, any dive heroes? Any dive heroes are going to be annoying. Basically, I think tanks aren't going to be too bad. I don't think it's the tank's job to shoot Mercy, really. I was saying that, like, it depends on, on whether you're coming up against good ones or not. He has Magnetic Grenade. True, but I think in, like, my eight or nine hours of playing Mercy, I've never really been hit by one. Again, could be totally skill issue, but at the moment, I'm not struggling with that at all. Bastion is definitely problematic. 100%. Uh, Ram. Ram, I think I can, like, ignore, right? Uh, Vortex. Orissa, I can ignore. This guy might be annoying. Junker Queen, I can ignore. Doomfist, I think I can ignore. Diva. Slightly annoying. But honestly, I haven't been struggling with Divas so far. Why do you have 76% of the achievements in Warframe? Damn, you've played lots. Uh, Echo is going to be problematic. Reaper. I think I can ignore Reaper. I just fly away from him and then he can't do fuck all. Same with Sigma. Just fly away from Sigma. Iliari is going to be annoying. I know that Iliari is annoying because I am annoying to other mercies. Kiri, I think I can ignore. Sim, I can probably ignore. Uh, Hanzo is probably going to be an annoying one. Torb. Torb turrets. Specifically. Uh, Zarya, ignore. Lucio. Probably ignore. Farah, possibly ignore. Winton might actually be annoying. Zen is probably an ignore. Depending on where I'm positioned. Because, like, again, like his projectiles are fairly slow. Junk is going to be annoying. Bap. Bap isn't too bad. Anna can be annoying hit scan. Hog annoying hook. Ball I can ignore. Okay, so it's gonna be looking something something like this. And hold up, we'll change this color to like a dark one so it doesn't stick out. Something like that. With the higher up they are, the more problematic they are to mercy players. This is like after a couple hours of gameplay, right? And even then, like I I could probably shift maybe a few of these around. Like Sombra, I don't really have problem with Sombra, but I know Sombra can be problematic. So if, as long as I, I figure out how to counter them. The idea here is just so I can visualize who do I need to learn how to counter myself over everyone else. Like I don't need to learn how to counter freaking Reaper because you just like fly away from him, right? It's generally not an issue. Whereas the Venture has been a huge issue. Genji, I know, is a huge issue. Ash, probably a big issue. Soldier is a big issue, but that's more from me playing Soldier into Mercy. Widow is going to be another one. I guess Widow. What do you do to counter Widow? Just like watch out for li lines of sight, I guess. But Widow is probably annoying, if anything else. I guess. Widow could probably come down here, right? Into the annoying tab. Then even then, like I think Ram, we could probably get rid of. Like obviously his vortex, but I mean, like if you watch out for the vortex, you're probably fine. Okay, so yeah, we need to figure out some of these top ones, or maybe Tracer as well. Was mm, yeah, Tracer can go up. Tracer can go up. Anyone who's like really dive orientated are gonna be like really hard to deal with. Do we have anyone else down here who's dive? Potentially Zen. I suppose Discord. But again, you just like hide for like three seconds and you're good to go. Like break line of sight. And that's going to be really easy and quick to do. 
So something like this. We, we shall refer back to this as we play throughout the day. But hey, that, that's going to be like our provisionary list for now. I don't think I'm doing too bad. Let's have a look at stats real quick. If it's going to give me time to do it. Quick play. Uh, hold up. Where is Mercy? That's not going to give us per season. I think one of the biggest ones we probably need to do is healing beam. Because most people, I actually asked for like some advice on Twitter. Uh, ba -ba -ba -ba. Where was it? Okay, here it is. So basically, I put out a comment on something basically saying, oh, I'm going to be playing Mercy. We got a few tips and stuff on here. So I'll have a look at these in a sec. I just got a match. Colosseo. I like, I actually like Colosseo. That might be a hot take, but I actually like this map. I think this is the best of the push maps. So what else do we have? Uh, no, I don't know. I like push. I, I realize that half of you are just going to like unfollow because of that, but <laughs> I don't actually mind this. It's not as bad as everyone makes it out to seem. It's just annoying, you know, when you're getting rolled and then you have to come back and win two pre fights back to back. Just to try and, you know, go past the middle line. I understand that. But in a balanced matchup, I don't think it's too bad. I really don't think it's too bad. Uh, right, we've got Venture again. We have... Bastion might be a really good one to actually pocket. We'll see, because ba Bastion does a shit ton of damage. And worst case, he's now going to do 30% more damage. Is it 30% 25? It's not much, is it? Oh wow, that was a terrible fucking Garden Angel. Oh, my freaking beam switched. Oh, because he went out of range, I guess. Doomfist. Alright, come on. You're hit scan, dude. What are you doing? Shoot! Shoot! He's not even getting any damage. Uh, I think I might have to reduce the sensitivity again. Oh my god, careful. I gotcha, I gotcha, I gotcha. I think. This is madness. Get him? You good? Oh, that's our one. Fuck me. Nice. God, oh, there's no help kit back there. There's no health kit. Where is it? Probably is now. Right. Oh, you're anti. You're anti. You're anti. Sorry, got nanodes. Oh, don't die! Oh my god, dude, careful! I just have to hold fucking left click on this guy, huh? Right, let's see if we can fuck up the supports a little bit. Oh no, I got slept! Ah, oh, dude. I'm missing a lot of shots. The thing is, this Barbie blaster is so slow on the projectiles. It makes hitting your shots, especially when they're going backwards and forwards. That's the biggest issue I encounter. Like, if they're just going one way, you can kind of adapt to that. But when they start strafing backwards and forwards, that's where that's where I struggle. Go on, damage, 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 damage. Hmm, okay. How are you on fire already? Did that actually hit you? Oh, because they have a freaking... Okay, never mind. Let's fucking shoot this guy. Oh, no!
Come on, get him, get him, get him, get him. Oh, no, 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 <laughs> shit, we all died, yeah, as soon as I saw, started seeing them drop like fucking flies, it was gonna be over, but I didn't go well, hey Kava, how you doing, Kava, we're becoming a fucking mercy main, we're doing it, we're becoming the e-girl everyone knew I always was. Lost the lead? Oh, what do you mean? Don't die, don't die! Fuck. You get revived. You need health. Oh, you got fucking nanoed. Yeah, I know you can't hit me. Cannot revive that. I need to watch out for that. I really do. Come on, Ash. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Bitch. <laughs> oh no, it's fine. It's fine. We're the evil kind of mercy. We're not the good kind. We're the kind who's gonna literally push our, our direct counter and then dip them. Or try to, at least. Ah, nice. Yeah, there we go. Okay, pushing Anna, not good. We need to get her ability out first. How do you miss both of those shots? What? This guy's like, try again? Like, I have almost as much damage as him. As Mercy. I don't think that's normal. I definitely need to get their freaking abilities out, though. Oh, uh, no one's coming back for the Mercy Taxi. No one cares about the Mercy Taxi. The Mercy Economy is not in a good condition right now. Yeah, like, if I can get to you guys, I can heal you. But if you hide... We good? We got this? Bring it, Reaper. Bring it. Bring it. What are you going to do? You missed me. You don't need healing. You lied to me. Don't ping if you... Oh, my God. What? Oh, my God. Okay. I got an angel to the wrong thing. Ah, dude. I missed the garden angel because someone ran in front of me. I might have to turn the sensitivity to that down. But then again... When I want to get out, I just want to get out. I don't want to have to be precise. Oh, the toss-up. We're winning, though. We're doing all right. That one, isn't it? Nice. We have alt. Nice. Uh, okay, I'm in bad spot. What are you going to do? What are you going to do, bitch? Bitch! Nice. Okay. We did a thing. We did a thing. You don't need healing! You do not need healing! You're fucking full health. Literally full health. Meanwhile, the tank who does need healing is just, like, chilling. <laughs> Huge pee-pee. First kill was fourth try- oh my god. Hey, we're trying, though! Right? We're trying. That sounded like a fucking Reaper behind us, though. Oh no, Reaper's dead. We're good. We're good. Fine. She likes the attention, oh my god. When these guys are gonna figure out. When these guys are gonna figure out. I'm a 32 year old man. <laughs> uh oh. No, I think we're all gonna die. Maybe. Are we good? We're good? Okay. Right. Bring the sh shield. Get it, get it, get it. Nice. Nice. 
Oh, dude. Screw you. Is it even worse? I don't care. I'm having fun. I'm having a blast with this. <laughs> Need to get above MR12 because... Wait, didn't you say you were MR30? How can you have 500 hours and only be MR12? You obviously haven't been going for MR then. Well, we didn't give a play of the game, but that's fine. That's fine. Uh, continue. We did get a play of the game, though. For anyone who missed it. You're spectating? Nice. Y you know there are other ways to spectate me. And, like, some of those ways actually come with live commentary and alerts and, and all sorts. And, like, a, a live chat, which shows on screen. And music and, y you know, there's a bunch of other ways to watch me play other than spectate me in-game. Mm -hmm. There are multiple ways of doing this. I might actually, speaking of spectating and stuff, I know that in many games, I have to kind of invite people as friends to be able to play with them. I think I'm going to change up how I was doing the whole friend system on Warframe. I think I might actually keep only friends or like people who I play with like all the time as actual friends. And then people we get in from, from stream will just happen to be like, we'll get them to send them a, a message. Oh, uh, here we go. There we go, we've turned chat off. I don't want to have to moderate another fucking chat, dude. Don't do that. Don't be that guy. Ugh. Right. Uh, where are they going to come out from? Here. Ah, wrong door. Don't, don't headshot me. Don't headshot me. Don't do it. They're trying. Oh! No! I got hit with a double fucking headshot, dude. Of a double shot, we got the Kiriko and the fucking Hanzo who got me at the same time. Oh, nice shot. Couldn't text in chat. I mean, you can. The problem is I can't stop you. And I don't want to have to moderate yet another fucking chat. And I do have to moderate it. You'll mod the chat. No, it's not that chat. It's not the TikTok chat. The TikTok one is fine. I can do that. It's the in-game chat. It's an in-game chat. I don't want to have to moderate. Oh my god. Okay, yeah, you just dead. Dead. Get him. Get him, dude. Uh, okay. Yeah, Reaper's not doing too good up there. Dude, okay, right. Chat, I know what we need. I need a better crosshair. I need a crosshair, which is gonna help me figure out how far ahead I need to aim when people are running. Use your fucking shield or something! Oh my god! Jesus, Sigma. Oh, we got a checkpoint as well. Shit, my bad. He's a chill person. Yeah, but I can't know that ahead of time, dude. And what ends up happening is you'll get other people in the match who will start getting salty because they now have an extra spectator that is typing in chat for no reason. It, it's it's weird. I just don't want to have to have an extra thing to moderate, right? And the problem is I can't turn it off. I can't stop people from doing it. It's fine. Okay. So yeah, I think with Venture, I just need to get out of the fucking way. Oh, yes, 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 yes. Damage boost, damage boost. Here comes dead. Get him, get him, get him. Come on, come on. Oh, I can't use... I can't use Guardian Angel in there. Shit. I cannot use Guardian Angel inside there. Noted. I should have stayed outside it. I must return to my post. You see, we're learning stuff. That's just something that I'm going to have to learn over time. Oh, 
Get my hands up, get my hands up, get my hands up. You can live. No, I said you can live, not die. Nice, let's go. I do not have freaking... I do not have my Battle Mercy stuff, though. Ah, dude! Why would they nano me then? I didn't have my ult. Nano Mercy sucks if you don't have your ult. It's fine if you do, but hey. I uh, wonder if you have any gold guns or jade guns But last year. I don't have any jade. I didn't get enough points. But I probably bought a couple gold ones. I probably did buy some gold ones. Yeah, you're just out of there, huh? Damn. Got not to use your gun so much. On Mercy, just try to damage, boost, and focus, heal. Ah, uh, fuck that shit. I want to play Mercy to have fun and, you know, actually play the game. Ah, uh, fuck! Okay. Yeah, I know I should technically be damage boosting instead. But I want to, you know, actually fucking play the game and not just stand behind a wall and right click someone. That makes sense. Still do Blood Hunt. We kind of stopped doing Blood Hunt a year ago, shouldn't still? Ever since they, they announced that they were stopping development of the game, we kind of like pulled away from it a bit. We have got a Blood Hunt stream next Friday. Not this week, but next week we are doing a, a Blood Hunt special. It's going to be for the two year anniversary of the game, basically. How it's still alive, I'm not entirely sure. Five kill, nicely done. Dude, just for that. Just for that, you get fucking endorsement. Don't care. Just saying because you're top 500. Oh yeah, th this is fine. And yeah, if I was doing this shit in top 500, I'd be absolutely smashed. But I I am like gold plat. So yeah, I don't think it matters nearly as much. I've watched you since 2022. Yeah, I think 2022 we're still doing Blood Hunt. Like, when was my last fucking Blood Hunt video? Mmm, YouTube. View channel. Videos. God, we're gonna have to scroll down a bit. We did a bunch of the finals. Overwatch stuff. Overwatch. Hawked. We're back here. 3,000 view. Eight months ago was my last one. I was getting really good with Blood Hunt, though. Like, the thumbnails for that kind of stuff. I was getting, I was getting better at doing stuff like that. No! No! She fucking locked both! Okay, well, the backup is Moira, right? <laughs> you played the final? Yeah, I played a shit ton of the finals, dude. I love playing the finals. The problem was that the content wasn't doing amazing. Wait, what the fuck is this? This is the new mode. Okay, I've no idea how to play this. I've no idea how to play this. This is like the fucking battlefield thing. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Anna? Fuck it, we'll do Anna. I can do a little bit of Anna. I haven't played Anna in a while. I'm gonna have to focus because my aim is not warmed up. I've been playing fucking Mercy. Uh, we need C, right? Right, so I think I know how this works. Ah, oh, I don't have my movement anymore. Okay, no movement means I need to position correctly. Positioning, positioning, and I've never played this map ever before. Hmm, we good? We don't look like we're very good. Oh no, that delay! We good? Live mercy. Oh, we got the fire! We actually got the fire. I do not want to be right in the middle there, though, dude. That was not a good spot for me. Ah, uh, dude. We're right behind it. Let me finish this off real quick. Okay. God, oh, I missed that. Where are we going? We need to go to B, right? Oh, and it's the first person to get the, the enemy objective, I guess. Oh, and we get close spawns? Nah, dude. Oh, I miss that. Okay, they're on B. Oh man, I guess it goes back to C if they cap, right? Uh, we need to push, but I don't know if we can. Nah, there's no way I can get in here fast enough, dude. 
Yeah, fall back, fall back. Nice. Tank is dead. Awesome. Got him. Since Life uh, Weaver was added. Yeah, Life Weaver's been... It's been... Dude, there have been a lot of really good changes since. Go for it. No, I missed the slip. No, I got the sleep. Yeah, fuck. Dude, what are we on? We're on six kills. We are carrying this fucking match right now. Because <laughs> you know what EDR I mean? I played a lot of EDR. I do enjoy it. I, I stopped playing as much EDR when they nerf the projectile sizes. Because I'm getting old. I'm getting tired. My aim isn't as good as it could be. And yeah, the reduced projectile size really did hammer me. Oh shit, sorry, I tried. Dude, we are way too deep. We're either way too deep or not deep enough. Yeah, I don't know if we can get this, dude. It's gonna be between fucking C and B, right? Where are you going, dude? He ran back to spawn. Ran back to spawn after all that. Oh, nice, we got the Pharah. I feel like I'm on the wrong side to be able to help my team. Ah, uh, no! Dude. Get fucked. Come on. Did we get her? Nice. I don't have my ability. Fuck, no! I got pulled by the nano tank. Ugh, shit. First teams have five points. Revive, let's go. So how many points do we have? Oh, it's two and two. But because we're capping this... Okay. I think I would have actually had that if she hadn't died immediately. Okay. So three points. Okay. I kind of like this mode. First time I've tried it. Dude, I swear to God. Someone remind me. I'm going to save this fucking replay. I'm going to send it to Sush. I'm going to send it to Sushi. I'll be like, Sushi, how do I improve? Yeah, no, tank. We have nano. I don't know if we need nano yet. Come on. We need, we need her to survive. God, oh, I missed. Miss asleep. sleep. Mercy is alive. Uh, am I getting pushed? The fucking far after me. Yeah, almost. Okay. You need to watch out. Are you going back in? Yeah, shit. Yeah, I'm fucked. I'm fucked. I'm fucked. I'm fucked. I'm dead. 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 Ah! Damn. Do Mercy who care going battle Mercy, right? Uh, probably. Probably. I've been learning how to play Mercy. I've got like eight hours on her. So we're learning. But yeah, I, I don't like sitting back and doing nothing. I will go in and shoot people in the face if it has to. If my teammates aren't doing it, I will. Because let's be honest, what's better? A 30% damage boost or a 100% damage boost? If we have a third DPS, that's 100% extra damage. Right? Contesting point. Who's contesting that? Oh no, Mercy! Rip. Can we have F's in chat for Mercy? Oh no, dude. No! I put her to sleep. They use two also. That's good. That's good. Mercy has hers. Uh, what else are we going to have? What are they also going to have? Probably Nano. Potentially Nano coming up. We've, we've got Mercy. We need to try and keep Mercy alive. Uh, Mercy, where the fuck are you going? Holy shit. Uh, Battle Mercy. Let's go. We do anything here? I don't know if we can. God, oh, what's shot in the back of the head? Damn. What is it? Sorry about me and my duo. We got a bit pissed because we've been having awful matches. We actually, oh no, it's rich. I, I literally don't care. But I'm ready for the fucking hate that everyone's going to be giving because of me playing Mercy. I'm ready for it. 
I'm waiting for it. Yeah, I know you guys need healing, but like we were dead. Oh my god, what are you doing? Right. We got the mercy. Can we give a tank? Ah, oh, this Farah dude. Love the Farah. Nah, dude. Someone shoot the Farah. I was doing so well at the start of this match. I was doing so well. Okay, we're not doing too bad. Sounds like him. Yeah, it sounds like me going in and doing Battle Mercy, doesn't it? That does sound like some. It's on character. Right, it's coming down to this point, dude. Whoever wins this point, wins. Oh, I missed that. My bad, my bad, my bad. Mm. Yes, I just tried healing the the bomb. Mm. Can we get Mercy or the Farah or both? Nice. I don't know if that really helps, but... Oh, Mercy, what was that res? Need to reload. Yeah. Ah, oh, fuck you! Nah, they just used three ults. We're fucked. They win. They win. I should have kept a little bit more distance, I think. Oh, Mercy, you almost with a touch. GG's. Oh, no! I was doing so well in the beginning there. I was carrying the fuck out of my team. Still got most healing. Still got most healing. Close game? Yeah, it was a close game. I'd much rather have a close game like that than, you know, actually rolling. You don't really have fun when you're rolling. It's just like, okay, well, everyone just dies. Oh! Yeah, no, our mercy wasn't on point. Not that I can complain. I've been doing a terrible fucking mercy. Stats aren't everything. Well, when you go through, like, the first two to three points, and you're sat on... What was I on? Like 10 kills? No deaths? Then yeah, that, that tells a story. Right, hold up. I need to use save this one. It was this one, right? Hanaoka. Uh, how do I share? Share. Oh, it's on the Clash game mode. That was my first time trying it. Uh, it seems fun. It seems fun. I, I, it took me a minute to understand like how we were actually going to win. But yeah, no, it, it seems balanced enough. Seems balanced enough. 14 knowing ranked plat one and we nearly lost. Yeah, obviously you can't carry everything. Not everything is carryable. Like you might have been going 40 and 0, but if the teammates were going 0 and 40, then yeah, you just get screwed over. Uh, guys, what I'm going to do is after this match, I'm going to go grab a sandwich. I need to eat. I'm getting hungry. I need to also make a phone call. So what I might do is we might pop on some Wordle on stream or like words on stream or something. Uh, we'll figure something out. But yeah. Everyone was 37 and 1. You can, not everything is carryable. Just because you got kills doesn't mean you got kills at the right moment, you know? Right. Can we get some early damage in? Early damage would be good. Uh, uh. There we go. Thank you. That's all I needed. Right. Now let's shoot him in the face. Is it a TDO? It's objective based. Yeah. There we go. 60 damage. That's better than nothing. That's more damage than half of the Mercy players get in a whole match. There we go. And then because we don't need to reload, we can do this. We can just switch instead, right? And that means we don't have to ever reload. Oh! Hooking onto the wrong fucking person. Keep him alive, though. Be nice. Where the fuck is your pylon? Okay, it's up there. Oh, I almost got hacked. Where the fuck did she go? Mmm, sus. I don't think she's gone. I don't think she's gone. Oh, doom! Doom, 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 doom! Yeah. 
This is a bad res. This is a terrible res. Ah, oh, I didn't have anyone to teleport to. Shit. Damn. Oh dear. Almost. I could have worked. If I had someone to to dive to afterwards, I think I could have got out of that. It would have been co closer. It's just about figuring out when the hell I need to actually res and when I need to just get out. I think it's survival above everything else, right? Survival above everything else. Get her, get her, get her. Them, them. That's going to take me a minute. All right, we got, we got one of them. Yes. Yes. Okay. We kept Idiari alive. Is anyone actually shooting? I don't feel like anyone's shooting half of the time. Oh no, I'm hacked! Ah! I got hacks. I couldn't fly. How are we doing? Who's gonna have alts? They've used that. They're gonna have hog. They'll just use that. Did they use nano? I don't think they use nano. We're gonna have nano and freaking yeah. Nano and what? God, oh, get fucked. Who actually killed? Yeah, it was the Samra. Okay. Samra's gonna be some. Okay, so what do we do in that situation? How do we stop that? How do we prevent that from happening? If you get your ult, you get healing during it. Okay. Yeah, oh, my good lord, dude. We're good. I think we're good. Oh, Doom! Doom! Doom, buddy! Doom took one look at that and was just like, nope. How have you got your all back and ready? Jesus, dude. Ah, oh, no. Okay, yeah, I'm fucked. I'm fucked. Ouch. Fine Guardian, you're in. You're getting a hat. Yeah, I think the problem was I just used it. So it was going to be on like a, a two second cooldown, right? Was it on? Oh, I can't actually use it yet. Two second cooldown. Holding ult for Overwatch 3? Something like that. Something like that. I don't know. I haven't seen a spot where it looked like I needed it. Oh, poor hog. No, we need it here. Oh my god, live! Live! Ah! <laughs> We're getting owned. See, I used it. You see what happens when I use my ult? This is kind of like a, a difficult one because like everyone can kind of get me in the air. Just not helping. Uh, hog, please stay alive. Ah, yeah. You see? When I get hacked... Look at these guys. It's quick play. Chill. Bam. Could have built a second one? Yeah, it's fine. Not the end of the world. Who's complaining? The other support. Bam. Yeah, this right here. Like, how the fuck did you get into this? <laughs> Look at me trying to shoot them in the face. Oh dear, right, hold up. Uh, let me come out of this, because I need to grab some food. I need to make a phone call real quick. Should we go for um, words on stream? Words on stream. I need to, I need to be like, right back. Uh, got it. Right, this is kind of loud. Can we turn the volume down? There we go. Okay, right, guys, do you know how this works? TikTok, I'm going to stop the TikTok stream. I'll start that again later on. So make sure you follow us on Twitch if you want to get your drops. Uh, I'll be going all day. I will be starting the TikTok stream back up again. 
But I need to go off and have lunch, and I know what happens on TikTok. People just scroll anyway. So I'll catch you guys in a little bit. Uh, enjoy, enjoy words on stream for a minute. You guys just have to type in words that you you think you see on screen, basically. And my camera's like kind of half on top of this. We'll get rid of that for you. That work? You just literally type stuff in chat. There we go. I'll get you so sorted. Started off. I'll see you guys in a sec, right?
All right, I'm back. I've got my lunch. I've finished on the phone. Dude, I'm fucking terrible at these. Are there other games on stream we can do? Because between Winton and I, we haven't managed to get through the first level yet. <laughs> um, I'll tell you what. Let's put that on pause for a sec. Uh, a couple things I need to do. This thing. I need to make a new one of them. Mm -mm -mm. Reuse settings. Because I stopped the vertical stream on YouTube. So to be able to get it back, I need to do that. Spectating solo. Spectating... They're, they're, oh, you can't do spectating solos in this, though, can you? You can't do it. Look. Let me show you guys some behind-the-scenes stuff. Analytics. This is from this morning, right? This is actually a good average watch time compared to some of my other videos. Or other streams. We had peak 38 on um, TikTok. Total of 70, 1,700. Not too freaking bad. Spectate someone from your friends list. I don't know who's fucking good. This is a comp game. Can you not spectate comp? I don't think you can spectate comp. Oh, mercy gameplay, let's go. We'll learn something for once, chat. That looks like she wanted to fucking shoot the fucking walls, dude. I think that was the little Symmetra turrets coming in. Trying to get rid of, which is definitely a support job. 100% a support job. DPS need to be doing damage. Support need to be taking out the little shitty things like that. <laughs> ah, there's half of my sandwich now all over the wall. Nice. 
Right, well, that, that was a good um, spectate. <laughs> I swear you brig. Damage and heal. I actually really liked the changes they tried with Mercy on April Fools. I actually really enjoyed those changes. It made it really easy to, to heal and do um, do damage and kind of switch between the two. Because, like, that's one thing I'd love to see, right? Yeah, sorry, I'm eating a sandwich. Chat told me. And then you're playing Mercy, which is perfect because we're trying to learn Mercy. April Fool's Mercy was seemingly a test for new mode. Oh, is that what they got in the new mode? Yeah, sorry. I wasn't trying to put you on the spot or anything. I'm just trying to have fun. Like, we were trying to do words on stream, but we couldn't get past level one. <laughs> so we had to do something else. All right, because what I'd like to see, right, is... Mm, so left click I've got is healing. Right click I've got is damage. But the way I'd like to see it working, right, is like I'd have a third button just for shooting with the pistol. And then it automatically shoots. You know how it does with Life Weaver? You know how it works with Life Weaver? Like, right click. I think I've got mine switched. But right click is heal, and then left click is shoot. You see, But you see how he switches automatically? I don't have to switch weapon. I just have to go left click, right click. And like, it, it switches automatically, right? I want something like that for Mercy. Don't worry, I'll be right behind you. Primary and secondary, yeah. So I I want like primary, secondary, and then I don't know, maybe, maybe even I don't know, fucking middle click. I could totally have. I could have left click, middle click, and right click, right? Because my middle click doesn't do fuck all. Ah, oh, it's reload. What does my R do? My R doesn't do anything. Mmm, okay. Let's try something, chat. I don't know if this is actually going to work. Uh, another reticle. We need to come back to that later. Reload. Okay. What if... Middle click swap weapon. I could do that. I'm much more familiar with having middle click as a reload, though. But the thing is, because of the way Mercy works, and because if you holster your weapon, that's ping, no, it's not ping for me. I have a third button. I have another button on my mouse for ping. It'll come up as like Y on here, but it's basically my mouse button, like underneath my thumb. Yeah, I have a weird thing. Do I have an image of it actually? Hmm. Did I not keep the fucking thing of my mouse? I'm sure I did. What? Do I not have a single picture of my mouse? Dude, I don't have a single picture of my fucking mouse. Light nurse. Oh, I, wait, what, why are they nerfing light? Why are they nerfing lights? Oh my god. No, it looks like I've got um, zero fucking pictures of my mouse. I had one. I definitely had one. But yes, you see, right click does nothing here. Right click does nothing. So what if... What if we had equip weapon one? It was also left click. Oh no, it takes it away. I can't have both. Ah, uh, fuck you. Hmm. So my, my initial thought was to, just to put primary fire as like primary fire and weapon one. That obviously isn't a thing. How can we make that work, though? 
Uh, because primary fire is two different actions. That's why. Primary fire is both healing and shooting. That's what's getting on, on my tits. Mmm, okay. Ah, uh, you see, you can't even put... Oh, it wouldn't matter, would it? It wouldn't matter. I'm gonna have to click, though. That's gonna be somewhat awkward. But, it's gonna mean that I'm gonna be able to click what- Ah, uh, yeah, no, I can't... Yeah, okay, so this is why I have it on scroll wheel and rather than click, because I can't... If I'm left-clicking, I want to be able to switch, which means my right finger has to come over, which is way more awkward to do when it's like that. Uh, okay. So let's put that back, actually. Let's have a reload here. Next weapon. Previous weapon. Hmm. I'll tell you what I need. Oh, do they not? I don't think they have this. Because, like, sometimes I feel like I'll scroll and it doesn't scroll, or it'll scroll, like, twice. What is it? I think it's from... Yeah, if I'm going away from the staff, it's easier to accidentally switch back to the staff. That's the same thing. Uh, I don't know. Check IRL chat. What's it up in IRL chat? What the fuck is this? What is this? The fuck? Warframe plush. Yeah, oh shit. Nicely done. Nicely done. Yeah, but you see, I can hold... I can hold left click, right? And then switch and immediately fire and then go back to that, right? And this whole time, I haven't let go of um, left click. I just wish right click would... I want three buttons. That's what I want. Primary, secondary, or like... I want to shoot... I want a heal and I want a blue beam. I want three separate buttons. Sky was green. Oh yeah, that's the update. Earth got an update. Did you not see, read the patch notes? Oh, what am I doing? Dude, there's patch notes. I haven't read the patch notes. Uh, where are the fucking patch notes? News? Patch notes. Mm, okay, so this is the, the trial. This is the thing we already played. Mm, 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 mm. Challenges, endorsement. Endorsement changes. Players who are actually with disruptive behavior and reduce to endorsement level zero cannot use text or voice chat features until they return to endorsement level one. I've never been zero, like, ever. Oh, you had a hell of a storm? We had... Uh, we had... Where was it? IRL, I think. Like, we, we chatted a bit in IRL yesterday. Uh... Wait, I missed this! What the fuck? When did this happen? Blair, you little shit. Damn, okay. Uh... Oh, shit. Here, here it is. Yeah, these guys had a, had a storm as well. Tyrannosaurus Mo.
Oh, it's, it's still playing. Okay, whatever. It'll be fine. Zero is new, right? I've never been zero. I've only ever been one. So I think zero might have already been a thing. But I think you have to get like a bunch of reports to reduce it from zero from one to zero. I don't think it naturally goes below level one. Like naturally it will only go down to level one and then stop. I mean you need something physically to push it below. Hide my name. Update your option in stream of attack found in your social options. Now we would hide your battle attack from other players in your group and from your friends in the match as well. When enabled, anywhere your battle tag is displayed to players during a match will now displays a random anon anonymized battle tag instead of only to the player with the hide my name setting visible in a This is how streamer mode should work. Games get this wrong all the time. Blood Hunt had this wrong. Blood Hunt had this wrong because Blood Hunt would only hide the name for the player who uh, the player who was playing. But it's like, I know what my name is. And if it hides it on my screen, but then someone sees me die and sees the kill feed, everyone else sees my name anyway. Now I have Winterman and Warframe plushies. Nice. I'll tell you what. One of the things I was thinking about, how much were these fucking points? Do we do a fucking giveaway for this? Ripoff. No, it's not a ripoff. It really isn't. Because while this is expensive, 100%, this is overly priced, it's expensive, but the, the... How should I put this? Because this is expensive, because people will pay this kind of money for one of the other skins, it allows stuff like the Battle Pass to come with coins in which reduces the overall amount of money that people have to spend on the battle pass for a bunch of skins which still means they can get the mythic skins so while yes those points are very expensive it is an overall good because you are taking more money from the people who can afford it and you are taking some of those savings and giving them back to players who can't necessarily afford it they will probably have more people buying battle passes with this. Yeah. 52 pounds for a skin. Yes, I agree. It's fucking expensive. But I actually really like this system. But yeah, no, it's a good thing. It's an overall very positive thing for the game. Very positive. Yeah, and you can still get the old ones. Like, let's say, if this season I didn't want the Mercy one, I could go and get the Genji one instead. It gives everyone who buys the Battle Pass more options. It gives everyone who buys the Battle Pass extra coins, which reduces the cost of buying into it. They'll make it not a ripoff. I wouldn't say ripoff. I don't think ripoff is the right term. I really don't. Yes, it's overly expensive for a in-game cosmetic that effectively doesn't actually change anything. Other than, you know, visually changing the game a little bit. While yes, it is overly priced for what the value that I would apply to an in-game cosmetic, the value that that is then bringing to the rest of the game is in there. Nearly impressive AAA game. Oh, and more, more than that. More than that. Y you could get, like, for this 75 euros, you could get Pal World, you could get Lethal Company, and you get, uh, get like, another one. A super, stupidly good games, you know? If you're missing a Mythic, you probably didn't like it. Uh, you gotta think longer term than that. You gotta think longer term. People take breaks, people come back to it, people people just weren't around at that time. Like, I started in Overwatch 2, right? Uh, like, basically at launch, and while I have most things, I don't have Genji's one. Because I started a couple weeks after the, the start of the game. I didn't know if, if I was gonna play it through or what, so I didn't end up getting the Battle Pass. 
Like, I think I ended up making it in the end, but... Yeah, but there's a ton of reasons why you'd miss out. A ton. But yeah, think about this long term. You're thinking way too short term. You're thinking over the course of the, the few seasons we've had. Think, think about season 30. Think about season 40. People who are getting into the game in five years' time. Who weren't even old enough to even be interested in Overwatch today. Think about them. What about if they become a stupidly, overly 